We are live. We are live. And ladies, hello everybody. Welcome in. Um, my voice you can hear. It's Janelle at Sarda at Jewelry. And we are going to have so much fun today because um, new things I get to design for you. So finally, the little dolphins, ladies, I got two sizes of the bracelet. I am so excited. I can't tell you how many times I did redid their little mouth. Their little expressions are so mischievous, so cute. And um, you have been going to town on the Rainbow Moonstone because it is beyond this world Rainbow Moonstone. So it's out of my own personal collection. Um, so I cannot wait to show all that. I've got a bigger ring and a really little ring. And ladies, it's that transparent stuff that they put in solid gold. So I cannot wait to show this. But um, how, if you're new, do you go, how do you shop with this? So um, I'm going to be back. You're going to see my face in a minute, but um, we're going to take you to a place to explain how you actually shop with this. But we love hearing from you too. So um, how to actually contact us. Ooh, don't forget this. Uh, this is a this show only special on the retention hoops. Oh my goodness. Everybody needs these in their life. Okay, we'll see you.
oh my gosh, um, it's so funny. Uh, they already read Di Diana. You already bought one. Diane. Di Diane. Diane. Wait, here I go again. I knew <laughs> you because you were my girl. <laughs> I gotta tell you today, the electrician guy, because uh, my AC is off right now, he must have told me his name 10 times. I had to keep asking. It's like, I don't know what's happening, uh, but it's okay. I'm here with you ladies, and I know all your faces. That's why I've got your picture book constantly going. So, um, are, you have, are you having fun? Yeah, the Rainbow Moonstone. Wait till you see that Prazio light. Remember how you said you wanted that white quartz cut? Yes. It, hey, wait a minute, a hexagon or, or I, I, or is it a, a, a hexagon? I think I've been um, calling it, whoopsie, see there's the, the name's gone. Okay, I was at a stoplight and I realized, wait a minute, one has six corners, oh, one octagon. octagon. I think I've been eight. calling it eight, it's a hexagon, which is six. Corners. It's so pretty, ladies, and the color, um, it was something I've been holding on to for a long time. And because we <clears> like <throat> the white quartz, um, I actually replaced the white quartz with the crazy white because it's something it's a collector's piece so i i just love sharing my stones that i've been collecting over the years um into my designs but um are you loving that little dolphin isn't he just so cute i love the little uh, drops that we're putting with them but um we are going to go into a few announcements do we have a giveaway of some kind today we are doing that friday but we want to thank everybody uh, our YouTube giveaway. Uh, okay. We wanted to try to get to 500 subscribers. Wow. And when we did, we promised we'd give away one of our Sterling Silver watches. And we passed that yesterday. So I am pulling all the names. And everyone okay. who participated uh, will go into the spinner. And we will spin for a watch on Friday. OK, I just feel like we just need to give something away today. Oh, okay. what are we oh now, I know we haven't done that for a while. It's hot. We're like. I gotta tell you, you ladies shopped because we did not have the product up. Um, we lost everything and had to start over. It was, it's kind of a mess. The team behind you, you're really exhausted. <laughs> but they're amazing. So Tanya, Michelle, and Nikki, thank you for uh, right. having this happen. And uh, what else, uh, what other announcements do we so, have going on? Uh, we wanna just remind everyone yeah. to log in so they can track their orders and see their history. And then when we do have coupons, they can use those. You okay. have to log in to be eligible for okay. those. The pre-sale ended last night, so thank oh, you for yeah. Great opportunity for them. I'm excited that they got such good deals. Oh my gosh, the multi-blue uh, opal uh, bracelet today. It's a different pattern, but same colors. Oh, are you getting it? Mm -hmm. So those items, I just want to remind everyone, will be shipping by July 15th. So we're processing oh. through that. Yes. Um, and then the Bali Base jewelry <gasps> has arrived. And yes. They're shipping out as well. And the dogs. And the dogs. And the dogs. Yes. So and so anyway, I know a lot of people have been asking about it. We're thinking in about two weeks, we'll do another pre-sale for the dogs, right? And the Bali Bay story will take another. Mm -hmm. But yes, we got those in early. So I'm really excited about that, Michelle. And then uh, one, the spe the, tonight, the pricing. So we have some one day specials. Yes. Those are good until um, tonight at midnight. Okay. And then all the other prices that they see will be valid until Sunday. So Sunday at 11.59 p.m., those will revert to 40% off. Okay. okay, I'm taking my shoes off because <laughs> I just here. realized it's getting hotter <laughs> and it probably would be better if I go barefoot. So I'm, I'm going to be barefoot with you ladies, okay? Okay, okay that's, so that's it. That's, that's it, that. okay. Yeah. Well, anyway, I'm excited to give you some tours of the stuff that I got to design for you. Um, and really, it, it's just it's such a joy because they're, they're just such fun little, oh, I just love this ring. I am going to have a hard time to trading so you're gonna have to definitely check me off with stuff today because um where do i go i think the rainbow moonstone because it's so spectacular and i don't have any more coming this is pretty much it but ladies um so you're used to seeing fully opaque okay where you can't see through it at all and that's where you get that that flash my that i collect has almost full transparency almost all the way through it which is just this beyond amazing quality, okay? So I'm kind of excited, it's a very small amount. When you get this big into that kind of clear material, it's, it's pretty, pretty amazing. So I've got two little rings that I'm gonna start out with. So I'm gonna show you. Um, this is the first little style, which I think is very mm -hmm. transitional. You can go with the Tree of Life design, you can bring Chain Link into it if you want. Um, but I love the little shoulders of the filigree work on it. But again, my amazing fit, I'm always gonna give you such an amazing fit. 
Um, look at this little cutie patootie. He is so cute. And you, uh, ladies, I, I can't even believe you've already been shopping on it. Um, the Rainbow Moonstone bracelet uh, already sold out the tip to tip that I was able to use the last few stones that I have. So anyway, what I did is I moved this um, and redid the ring to where they're on and a little more comfortable too. So ladies, I've got that. So isn't he just delicious? And just, just a cute little um, addition there. So I love that there's two different ranges of sizes for you too. But um, that material, um, yeah, almost impossible to find anywhere. Like it's literally double digits, but high double digits. Like um, some of this, to be honest, is actually more expensive than that really light uh, tanzanite. It costs more per carat, isn't that crazy? Mm -hmm. I know, rainbow yeah. moonstone, who'd have thought? So uh, but this one, is the collector kind. Okay, go ahead. The yes. one on your middle finger is $69.99 on Jodo. Oh my gosh, that's ridiculous. And the Cutie Patootie is $49.99 okay. that I think is going to end up on my finger. I, I know, <laughs> right? I well, and that's, that's the thing is, I need to keep. <laughs> well, and here's the thing. I got this, like, I used to collect it all the time because nobody really thought with the Rainbow Moonstone. So I'd go ahead and select a bunch of stones all the time. Uh, when I went to India cutting. So this is really a collection of over 30 years that I that I was able to collect things. So um, if I were to price this at realistic prices for me to reorder, this would, no, these would not be this price. So that's what's kind of exciting is, um, no, I don't really do that. And, and you know, I add like every gemstone, the resources are gonna be endless, which we already know they're not, but um, I, I love it. You're my friends. You're my family. You're my friend of family. And um, I, I'm a big sharer. I will never have a lot of wealth ever. <laughs> because, yeah, I, I just, uh, that's my language of love. I love to, to so make So the earrings were $59.99. Oh, actually, yeah. For the rainbow moon. So I earrings. should measure those, sorry, because I'm going right into the dolphins because I feel like, oh, he wants to go into the middle and swim around in the rainbow moonstone. Oh, Whoops. oh, on centimeters again. Are you starting out? Um, are you starting out trying? Please babysit me a little more carefully today. <laughs> okay, so, oh, and look at, these are those really skinny, you know, I redid the, the wires, so they're the really cool elongated wires. Oh my gosh. Ladies, are you loving this new style, the, the new one that I redid? Whoops, mm -hmm. there's Mama again. She, Mom always wants to get on my tray here. Okay, what do we got going on here? Okay, so um, I think I'm going to go straight into the dolphins, though, because they're just too cute. Mm -hmm. Look at look at the little earring. Look at the little Tree of Life design. I brought in a couple cuffs with the filigree. That will be so pretty next to these two. But don't forget, you can always put your roses from God with everything that you have also. But yeah, he's just a perfect little... Um... Oh, it's so funny. I had my nails redone, and it's kind of a peach. Ooh, that looks really awful. It looks like yellow <laughs> under here. In person, it's actually pretty um, under here. I'm not sure if I'll do that again. Okay. So the earrings are $64.99, and that is on Jodo. Okay. So I it's love a brand it. new item. Look at In the bigger version, and you get three. Yes, you get a family here. Oh. Is it? Look at the baby. Oh. And, of course, I wanted to bring in more, you know, a little bit of the flat jawline pieces. And just make it fun because dolphins are so fun. But man, the balancing on this one to get the curvature just right in this, um, boy, did we redo it a lot of times. But it is, it's just perfection. But yeah, it's its really kind of, it's actually hard when you go in and to really carve those to get a really cute little face on them. I like too. how you use the different motifs on each dolphin, Janelle. Mm -hmm. That's cute. That way, it's like I'd love my ladies mm -hmm. to be able to have that ability right? to mix in and such, you know? So yeah, anyway. that one was sixty four ninety nine as well. Yeah, that is so amazing. And then the um, ring is fifty nine ninety nine, and the bracelet is going to be one thirty nine ninety nine. Oh, that's so good, Michelle. Thank you. I love it. Okay, so let's go to the little baby ring because he is just too darling, isn't he? Look how cute he is. Get the little detail now with him i i just did the flat jaw ones going here and here to kind of pull in the pendant um but he is a true bypass so um i did him i made the shank very very thick too so you could have that adjustability but look at the beautiful gallery that's all in, in set 
um, because I really want to give you that really amazing snuggy hug fit. But he is true to size too, ladies. So definitely, um, yeah, look at his thing. He's just so fun. So um, four piece set. I love doing four piece sets. Mm -hmm. And so do you see the little ball that he's like putting in the water and the little waves that come up uh, with the ball and the little dolphin? Um, and really, really substantial. I gave it really, really beautiful um, hammered with the little flat jaw going down. So fully adjustable, and there's two sizes. So one, this one's perfect for me, I just love it. I, you know what's so funny? I really love the tip to tip with it, but I'm gonna have to stick a multi on too. So we have a size six, seven, five, fitting a six to seven inch wrist, and a seven and a half that's gonna fit a six, seven, five to a seven, seven, five for one thirty nine ninety nine. Yeah, I'm gonna have to add some, um, because did you see the bracelet with the rainbow moonstone in it? Mm. Yeah, there's two of them. Um, truly one-of-a-kind pieces so I wanted to use the opal so I used the really beautiful um, opal and then I snuck in because this is gonna be one of my topazes ladies that I, I use a lot it's the sheer luck topaz okay and so um, I, I love mixing the light and the dark blues to make a bracelet and a collection that could really be year-round right so um, I'm going to show you a couple coordinating pieces along with the rainbow moonstone. I decided to bring in um, the sheer luck and this fluorite. I got to tell you too, ladies. I've got the fluorite in this, but it all kind of matches and coordinates back. But this is the little ring. It's your favorite. I told you I was going to do more. Okay, so I decided to bring this little guy back um, into um, the sheer luck. So that's gonna come back and play into this, the sheer luck, which is kind of that sapphire tanzanite kind of uh, peel. Because with the sheer luck, you get like those really beautiful tones of like tanzanites, some purples, but you get that really deep, dark sapphire blue that is just so pretty in it. Um, so that's gonna tie back. And what I did is sometimes I just like to sneaky peek, just uh, I wanted to bring in some earrings so this is going to be the really beautiful filigree um and this is um my artisans just really doing their best and um again every single piece and little wire here is all hand done i think these would be earrings that you would like be your little go-to you see the little jawline beads that are all hand placed graduated going up um again it's that really elongated skinny wire so you're not going to lose your earring um, and again with the sheer look. So I kind of mix that in if you want to kind of bring those um, darker tones into your bracelet also um, because I love the lights and the blues. If you have blue topazes, I mean, really this, this bracelet, blue topaz would be just so beautiful with it. I put rainbow moonstone. I do a lot of blue topaz with rainbow moonstone a lot of times too. So this is what's going to match back with that. Um, I already showed this, showed this. Okay, I wanna make sure I, oh, gee. <gasps> yes, yes. And you ladies, of course, the ones that are getting the bracelets, I'm gonna be matching the pendants up with uh, whoever gets matching sets. Um, that will get pulled tomorrow first, okay? Because I'm crazy about, I always, when I do it, I always do a bracelet and a pendant and I match them and that's how many. So I've made exactly the same amount of bracelets to pendants um, so ladies, you will, yours will get pulled first. Um, that's only tomorrow though, because um, after that, um, it's, when people don't buy a set, it's, it's almost impossible for me to, to keep up with it. So there will be, um, it's still, I'm pretty good at, uh, you know, having other things that, that blend in, but it's almost like a perfect match, which uh, I always try to go for um, when I'm doing things for you. <laughs> The three stone pendant is $99.99 and that bracelet Janelle is gonna fit a six to a seven and a quarter inch wrist for $199.99. I was doing this really cool bracelet uh, fit that I almost finished, Mickey, that I'm gonna have you put on the website. So you'll be able to get a fit, fitted, average, roomy, uh, relaxed or roomy fit. So I'm giving on different, when we say it fits wrist this to this, um, you'll be able to fine tune it a little bit better. Um, okay, I, this, Ladies, did I tell you this? This is going with everything, everything that I'm mixing and matching. Um, this is a huge color. 
Um, this year for me, a huge stone is the blue quartz that you're gonna see a lot um, in my little limited pocket collections that I'm doing. So, um, man, this bracelet is just luxury, luxury. So anyway, I have a couple other stones coming in this bracelet because it is um, the bee's knees. It is one of the best bracelets that I've done. Um, just the fit and curvature, it doesn't matter if you're a six inch wrist, um, up to, um, what, was, what does that go up to? It goes eight. up to an eight. And I know a lot of the ladies are mentioning they would like those eight inch bracelets. Mm -hmm. So that's it's, a great one for them. Yeah, it, Michelle, the way I've done it, it's gonna curve. Uh, the, these pieces curve, these curve. It's going to feel like I customized it for a six inch wrist like myself or an eight. So um, you will absolutely love that. And the reason I'm doing this, because I want to show you, um, see, here's more of the blue quartz, okay? So here's another collection. Oh my gosh, right? Uh, um, is this that? This is the cornflower blue, isn't it? That I designed with it? Yeah, I couldn't remember. I, I mixed a bunch of different opals, and I think mm -hmm. that's the one I landed. But ladies, this is the color, uh, the uh, violet fluorite, okay? So that's the blue violet fluorite. Um, and what I did do is I did do a pendant, okay? So this is the first time I've done a 14 by 10 stone in the pendant. So you could go this kind of look because you know, um, if you bought the other collections from me, um, you know I did do, and there's gonna be some other little pieces that will kind of coordinate and match back and forth. But you know I did this ring um, in the blue fluorite also. So this is something that um, you might already have this. This set will be beautiful with it. Or you might already have the pendant that matches this. But um, I wanted to bring that back in and remind you that I do have uh, that one also. And the blue fluorite bracelet is gonna fit a six to a seven and a half inch wrist, $199.99, matching pendant, $89.99. Yeah, it's so funny. It's like, oh yeah. I love it like this. This is my favorite to wear. And it we like had a this. question: How do they make the blue quartz? Is that a natural stone or color change? Okay, so this it? one. Um, okay, so there's different blue quartzes. So this particular blue quartz, this one is lab created blue quartz. Okay, so this one is um, one that is actually they take a seed of a blue topaz and they grow it in a lab. So you'll you'll get a lot of color variations and shading with that too. But I really go for this really, like to me, that cobalt kind of blue color. So if you put a gem tester, you test it, it's literally quartz. It's not glass like a CZ, but it's literally tests as a, a, a real gem. Because it is, it's just done in a, uh, in a lab. Diana was asking if the balling waters would match the blue. How wouldn't that be beautiful? Oh my gosh! Blue? I've got the I. You know what? I have the balling waters and some fluorite that's going to be coming. I actually have that mixed on a tray. I think next week Ooh. that I brought the balling waters in with it. But yes, the balling waters with all of these actually would really coordinate, especially because it it does go with that sheer luck too. So yeah, you could mm -hmm. can't go wrong. Oh, a lot of you ladies have the demorite bracelet, so I brought that in just because all of these will coordinate so beautifully with your uh, bracelet. Um, you might already have this. So I kind of wanted to show you how pretty that is too um, with it. And we have the two sizes in the Demorderite. We have a size six, seven, five fitting a six to seven inch wrist. And we have a seven and a half, which is gonna fit again, a seven again to the eight inch wrist. So. Uh oh, my neighbor's cleaning. Uh, I hope you ladies, Tanya's can cleaning. you hear it? Tanya's um, closing the windows. Oh, okay. Whoops. I, I just had a feeling like my neighborhood is like crazy about yard work, man. They're always out there. So um, I, I didn't think we were going to get that lucky with the AC not being on that <laughs> without having our uh, some breathability. Yeah, so, so ladies, I apologize. Um, but you know what happens is, yeah, it's sometimes a bit of a wait when something goes wrong. I love this little band. Now this one, um, I'm pretty sure I would double check because I think this one, I always say go up a size you did. in this size one. Okay. So um, it's one of those ones. Um, anytime I do filigree, I tend to, e even if I size it up a little bit for you, um, you're just always safe. Like I'm an eight, this is an eight. That's why I have to wear it on my sevens. See if it it's perfect on my seven. So, yep. And that is. Go up a size on that. $59.99. So, and there you go. That's the same kind of really pretty little shape. And this one's done in an antique octagon cut. So this mm -hmm. has got a really special little cut on this one also. 
So this is in the same league as the pink sapphire created uh, pink sapphire. So I just I just love this little guy, and he is he's one of those blues that um, has been one of my most popular gemstones. Um, I've used that for about thirty years. That that same blue, um, just absolutely love it. Now I did bring in two little opal pieces. Okay, um, that can coordinate back if you want to pull that opal out. And if you have any of the cornflower blue uh, from me already, this will all coordinate. I did a really beautiful uh, cuff bracelet uh, with a kickback in the cornflower blue that this would be so beautiful with. So I did one of my really classic styles in it. Um, I just love this little pendant. And so I, I definitely would love to do some other gemstones in it. It's just that perfect little size. Like it's not too overstated. Um, just love it. And that is $64.99. With it's Jodo. Mm -hmm. This is Jodo, that's why. And yes. a matching ring at $59.99. Okay, and this is just that great little band. I don't want to take any of the rings off again. And mm -hmm. true to size, so take your, your real size on this one. And um, love this one because it's, it's definitely for a gemstone, more of a low profile uh, piece also. Um, where this one obviously is like more of a stand-up ring, you know, has a little bit more dimension. Oh but I love the ladies. Do you get so many compliments when you wear this, uh, this kind of style too? Oh, you know what? If you want a bigger look too, you always can. Like I've got this little stack here. So if you want to create a bigger look, what you do is you take, um, I've got this uh, hammered stack ring in it, um, and you can stack along and create um, something a little bit more on a ring like this, okay? So if you want to make this a little bit more fun like that, you can always do something like this and get a bigger bang for your butt there kind of look. We have a question. Uh, Barb Blanco is, this is our first time tuning in. Oh, and welcome. And she wants to know how to make a purchase. And you can go to the Sarda.com website. And all of the items being featured on today's show are on the drop-down menu under Socials and Specials. Click on Tuesday Socials and Specials and you can purchase all the jewelry here and i drop a link into the feed as well and obviously i create a customer account too so oh wonderful oh, i love that hey did you notice i snuck two little pieces in oh let's go to the this show only earrings are you kidding okay so we did bring these back in i know ladies um we had kind of a special on these uh, this is that amazing earring one of my favorites like in history that i've designed and made for you and been selling for close to three decades now uh, this is my famous watermark pattern that um i used and i copyrighted and um in some of my first beads and such that i used um and then you've got the little hidden flowers in between the little pebbles it's so funny because this always reminds me um it was so funny because at the time that i designed this we didn't have this existing but we've got this little waterway in bali it's like a path that you know goes through our compound and we have big rocks like this that you literally have to like walk and there's water in between it like water oh, so cool. you don't want to miss miss one of the the things so it's literally from the ground it's water that's all underneath it and we have these really beautiful purple flowers that grow up matter of fact they grow Ooh. so quite we have to cut it down quite a bit and it is just the coolest thing. Very beautiful, but like if you have kids, you probably did, would not have that. So I always told Kadek, you know, when the girls start having the grandkids, like this isn't gonna work. Like we're gonna have to put a mesh over like the edges or whatever. It's like, yep, yep, we'll do it when we get there. But anyway, it, it just, um, sometimes we literally get the jewelry and we're inspired in architecture over in Bali too, because anything's possible in Bali. Oh, you know what? I can take this off. Why don't I show my favorite, favorite little uh, ring? Uh, so many of you ladies already picked up on this. And it's just that really fun statement ring. Um, it's done in the, the high polish. Um, and then I just love the little beadwork on each of the little corners. Very detailed. Um, I love my personality all silver rings. Uh, I love a good statement ring like this. Um, and definitely, I'm hearing you ladies get noticed in this ring, so I'm so glad so many of you already have this piece. Um, okay, so... We have a question oh, regarding yeah. Pure Luck Topaz versus Sheer Luck. 
Are they the same, different? Oh, did I say, it's Sheer Luck, sorry, did I say right. Pure Luck? No, I thought you said Sheer Luck, but is there a stone that you've used called Pure Luck, or no? I don't uh, recall anything, I just... You know what, I wonder if the girls, no, it's always Sheer Luck that I've used. Oh, okay. Pure Luck, you know what, I, I, I can never say no, because what, if there was, mm -hmm. because, you know, I've been doing this for so long, but Sheer Luck is kind of my signature one. Okay. So now there would be other people that I, that might have taken that and <laughs> taken it to another thing, maybe. And, and then Gina was wondering, I, apparently the larger Moonstone ring is sold out in some sizes. Are we going to be bringing no, that No, I can't get this quality. And oh. now here's the thing. I can get with all opaque, no translucent. Like, they just don't. Um, so we're looking into getting some of the other Moonstone and seeing. Um, but... I've, I, I'm a big moonstone collector. I, I'm, I, I've got to be careful. My quality that I want for you ladies is not the most affordable. Uh, but for me, I want gemstones that are pretty um, for sure. I always go for pretty, but I always look for the rare too. So especially when I'm using, you know, things that are genuine or natural, you know, I always go to the higher end of it. So yes, I will always try. Um, but my problem is that I get them and then I give them away, which is not going to keep me in business because it's like, I'm like, oh, it's too expensive. <laughs> We're going to sell it at cost. So, yes, I'm going to be looking. Like, I, I've got some people out there right now um, looking. So, we'll, we'll see. I, I would love it if I could, man. Are you kidding? Absolutely. I rubbed around a lot of moonstone if I could. But... I mean, the opaque is really pretty too because you get really pretty blue flashes. It actually has to have disruption in it. It flashes. Um, it's harder to get a flash when it's clear though, just so you know. Um, the blue, okay? So it's harder to get the blue in something of this where it comes more common sometimes in the uh, stuff that you can't see through. And the Starry Night um, oh, the story night. ring, um, I have a note here that we should size up on that. This one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And that one's... Oh, and no, this one. Sorry. Uh, or no, I might have done both. You, yeah. I might have said, said size up you on did. both. You I did. did. You I did. I did. Yeah. Yes. Because this one, it's just the way... See how I shape the band out in this Euro shape? It is so comfortable, but because of that, it takes up a bit of space. So I said you'd be better off sizing up in that one because it is. But look at the side. <gasps> look at that. It's so good. Mm -hmm. Oh, I love the shape of this. Oh, Athena wants a, just an all silver ring like this. She's like, could you please mm -hmm. now? So we might be working on an all silver version in this. Oh, this that shape. would be cool. Yeah. yeah. So the ring and the matching pendant are both on Jodo for $69.99. And so. Then, oh, go ahead. I was going to say, and that ring is $79.99. So this is, yeah, two kind of totally different looks. This one's a little more contemporary, right? Mm-hmm. And so here's the difference, though, too. This one is just the um, simulated opal. This one is the simulated opal with the micro-faceted uh, genuine quartz top. So just so you know, you know how I, I always do things. So that is the same material, but with the quartz top but they completely oh, coordinate okay. together, That's okay? So they're both Starry Night, but um, I did two different uh, things to them, okay? So we ended up, this one in person is just amazing, like, because you get more color play going straight into cutting the material. Um, I loved them both, so I did <laughs> I did a little bit of both. Mm -hmm. But um, we literally took a vote. This one in person is so impressive, so beautiful. like. I always think it shows pretty here, but when I go to watch the video back, I'm like, oh my gosh, it doesn't show like it does in real person. Mm -hmm. Like it's, ladies, anybody that has the story nights, do you find that to be true that it's way prettier in person than when I show it? They probably do, I would imagine, because I've seen that too. I see comments a lot like, oh my God, it's so pretty. Yeah, it, it, yeah, it's one of those ones where sometimes it does translate different mm -hmm. and be so, it's, it's so much more in person. You know, the, um, we do. Jennifer was wondering if you could compare the cornflower, twilight, and starry night opals all side by side. So when you get a chance, they could see the different opals. This is my favorite ring. I just gave this one away um, 
it during our bunker night too. She, man, she just loves it. I just, again, one of my favorite rings. I, I'm gonna be doing a pink stone in this um, because it, it's, oh, I love it. I just think it's so elegant, so sophisticated, but it's so comfortable on too. So one of my, uh, you know, it's hard for me to find something where it's like, yes, next level for you ladies, next level. So cornflower, this, and this one. So I think they want to see all three of them, maybe. Is that what the, the corn, did I hear three? Cornflower, Twilight, Opal, and Starry Night. Oh, the Twilight. Yeah, okay. I think it's on a different. So tray. um, yes, I think it it's is. On a different tray. So, oh, wow. Twilight is like a bright turquoise kind of blue. This is a deeper, almost like midnight blue. And the cornflowers is just really soft, soft blue. That one looks better in person too. Mm -hmm. It's not picking up the other colors. Colleen wants That's that, in this one, Darnsey. Colleen said yes, that the cosmic skies is much more gorgeous than per person. It's like, it's one of those, yeah. These are gonna, oh look at, it's missing the green. Like when you pull it out, you have the green. Mm -hmm. That's why sometimes these stones don't, yeah, that's not showing good. Um, yeah. Twilight, I ha this is something new we've been using. Just so you know, Twilight is our number one selling opal that we do. So if that helps in that aspect of, like, you know how our Caribbean stones are our number, like this has been a huge, our Caribbeans, the twilight is the one that goes with that. So if you're like, oh, like crazy about our Caribbean, like probably 80% of ladies have bought in Caribbean for me, that um, the twilight will be your color that you're like, yes, that you go to, okay? But again, the opals are so pretty, you might start collecting a bunch of the different colors because they do really look beautiful together. I mean, you really can combine a lot of those together. Um, two sizes on the bracelet that goes with this too. So you're getting two different ones. And so like this opal too, it's definitely a cobalt blue background. You get pinks, greens, that type of thing with this one. With the twilight opal, you're getting a bright green and two colors to three colors of blue to turquoises, if that makes sense. And the two sizes in that bracelet, a six and a half fitting a five seven five to a six point seven five wrist. And we have a seven and a half fitting a six seven five to a seven seven five, one forty nine ninety nine. And if you're getting that opal, um, this ring, the banding on this ring is perfect to match this. So um this would be the ring I would suggest, and it is my statement ring, and it is butter. It is like this is one of the ones, ladies, that I just I get so happy sending home to you because I know it just it's one of my larger statement rings that is just so comfortable, so comfortable. So however you wear it on your hand, um, yeah, it's it's an it's an experience wearing my um, statement rings. Um, you might not if you've gotten anything not from me. Um, they usually are not going to fit like this. They're going to flop around, but the way that I do the galleries is literally it's this huggy snug fit. It literally suctions kind of to your hand in a comfortable way, right? Not an awkward way. And so that's really pretty. Okay. We so have, we have a lot to show tonight. Let me tell you. Yes, Michelle, go ahead. I was going to say we had a... To your window, go! <laughs> <laughs> Speak, speak. Um, so is there any <laughs> special care needed for the simulated opals or the opal triplets? Um, the, re, the, the simulated opals, um, triplets, anything doublets, triplets, you don't want to soak in water or anything like that. But in the bezels, they should hold up just fine. Um, you know, um, the simulated opal we um without the quartz because we're starting to cut the opal now um and getting away from the quartz top a little bit because the material is so pretty and i finally got somebody to cut it properly so um we were having difficulties with it getting cut it comes 
uh, where we were doing the, the slice on the bottom. So I think you're gonna see from me a lot more without the doublet to it. However, the twilight is not as pretty. It's only pretty with the doublet. So um, yeah, just don't be soaking it in your jewelry cleaners, which you shouldn't be doing that with stones anyway. You should just be cleaning it and then wiping it off. Um, but I don't, I don't like to be too careful with any of the jewelry because I try to make the quality of the silver something you can live your life in. I don't want you to have to worry about not it not holding up. So um, we're always gonna be here for you. So, um, and let us know if something ever goes wrong, we will for sure take care of you. And then the um, blue beads, the tiger's eye, seeing that- Which one? The blue tiger's oh, eye. Oh, yes, 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 I'm so sorry because the blue tiger's eye does go so, it's so pretty, Michelle, um, with those. So thank you because I did want to pull those in because with the sheer lip, the topaz, the sheer lip topaz, yes, BDS 432. And then this is the 10 millimeter bead. And we don't have multiple sizes in this one yet, ladies. So, <clears throat> um, but I'm going to be showing a bunch of beads that have multiple sizes for everybody. This is the eight millimeter bead. It's the BDS 431, okay? And um, you'll see your size and fit. Um, but if you're new, um, did it, was it Barbara? Was Barbara new? Yes. yes. Please make sure you get one of our bracelet sizers, okay? Um, and you'll get the ring sizers also. Uh, I give you a thick ring sizer for like, if you're wearing rings like this, statement rings, you wanna measure with a thick one. We also give you the thin one because if you're, buying the single rings like this and this you'll probably buy a different size so like me i'll buy um one size my, my normal size in something like this but sometimes i'll buy a size up when we go into a bigger ring that says size up okay so um you'll want to know what your finger size is okay um and you'll want to know what your wrist size is because on my bracelets i will always say uh, this bracelet fits a six and a half to a seven and a half inch wrist. So if your wrist measures at a six and a half, that would be your bracelet. Or if it, you know, so size does not equate to what your wrist size is. Okay, so there's always going to be a size of the bracelet. Uh, you don't really want to look at that. You want to know what your size of your wrist is. And then you're going to go read our bracelets and it says fits wrist sizes from this to this. Okay. And I never got why the industry didn't figure this out. So I kind of created my own little wrist sizings to help you out because once you start wearing bracelets, you're going to love them, especially good quality ones like I get to design for you. Um, you'll, you'll love wearing bracelets again. And um, yeah, I definitely design for stacking and or just even single um, bracelets to put with your smartwatch or your Fitbix. That, those kind of things. So, and then can you show the Roses of God uh, bracelet? Oh yeah, 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 Please. absolutely. We have, we have two sizes. I had it sitting here. Sorry about that, because <laughs> I had it on the whole time. Thank you, Michelle. We have two okay. sizes now. We have a six seven five, which is going to fit a five seven five to a six seven five wrist, and we have a seven seven five, which will fit a six point seven five to a seven point seven five wrist for one sixty nine ninety nine. This is our luxury bangle. This is um, here's the opening right here. There's a retention, say a press button closure where you just press it and then you open it up. But there's a retention. So um, this and this gives you two safeties that you'll have on your bracelets. But this is definitely probably yeah for this show. We're oh I have one other luxury bangle. I have two like pretty amazing bracelets. Oh, actually, and I have the filigree one too, I forgot. But I've got like, if this is more your edgy, cool, like style like this, love this one because this one is a magnet and a retention. I love the shape of this. Oh my gosh, it's so cool. But anyway, so um, yeah, so I always design bracelets for everybody, you know? I mean, there's something for everybody in my collection whether you know you want something smaller, but the roses from God, yeah, you go on, the ladies will tell you if you're a new customer, it's a must have. <laughs> oh yeah. Okay, oh. and it's actually gonna go with all of what we're doing over here too with the pinks and such. <gasps> ladies, okay, this is a start of a series of more things that are gonna be coming in. Wow, 
right? Um, stones again, some new things. Here's uh, the pure pink topaz. So I'm bringing in a bunch of really hot pink topaz. It's called pure pink. Um, then crazy light. Um, are you kidding? Like my crazy light collections, I'm. I pretty much am bringing them all in this this month, okay? And um, the last two months, and this is going to, was supposed to last me the whole year. Um, but look, I, I love the graduated. I brought in my old um, John beadwork that I did. Um, but whoa, look at that stone, ladies. Look at the look at the cut. Look at the star that's in it. And the star goes all the way into the center of the stone. So this is a competition cut, close to 300 faceting pieces um, of the lapidary um, when they wait, they do this. So this, like I said, was in my private collection. Oh, what size did I grab? Okay, this I think this is a 10 or something. Sorry about that. Oh. Um, yep, I, I've been out of control with my pulling. Like, oh, you know why? Because I actually put this on a couple shows because um, coming up, so I think I probably ran out of sizes. Look at that. So it's a great price too, Janelle, $79.99 for that ring. That's amazing. And the color is phenomenal. Now I'm going to tell you the cut. I the, the cut is mm -hmm. just spectacular. Really cool. But mm -hmm. all my crazy old light. Look at this one. Look at how the cutting on this one uh, goes down too, though. So this is like a really cool step cut, but it's. Uh, buff top so that means it's capped on the top and faceted all the way into the bottom so I I mean both are absolutely exceptional I use the Bali high topaz that is exclusive to my collection you won't see that anywhere else uh, Bali high topaz and it's like this gorgeous tealy chrome uh, green that is just so beautiful so you're gonna see me using that with a lot of things so I had to bring both because Somebody who like is into a stone, they're gonna go full like armor. They're gonna be wearing both. <laughs> so you're gonna be adding on probably because again, Praise Your Light is one of those colors that goes with so many things. The abalones that I do, the chrome dioxides that I do, um, the chrysophases, the chalcedonies, the prenites. These are all the, the Praise Your Light loves, love being mixed in with those kind of gemstones. And um, I love the best kind of quality praise you like. So yes, you asked and I am doing it, ladies. More of these um, shorter uh, bales, okay? And some of the pieces. So you will have this that will go over all of our necklaces. And um, at the beginning of the feed, you're always gonna see we'll have the Bali chains and the snake chains um, available for you. And um, we always do multiple lengths. Okay, so some will have a four inch extender, some will have a two inch extender. Um, and really my product, my, my designs really do look the best on these types of chains. Um, but if you choose the one with four inches, this is what you're gonna get, the twisted rings, okay? If you get the ones with two inches, you're gonna have these little bit more upgraded, thicker rings. Um, I love this style, both of them, because really it's part of the design. You can wear these chains in the front as a, also like a lariat style, because I always put my little term on the end. Um, but, or you, you can wear it like this with the lobster. See, I want the lobster going down. You can wear it like this to where it's like a little cute little anchor and you put your pendant here on it. Um, but there's many, many different ways that you can wear these chains. Um, they're more of a necklace. So you, it's a standalone by itself or, um, and I, I think they're just key. And so I've been trying to just bring those in at an everyday low price. See how pretty that is just like that. Or you wear it like a normal chain and just, just like this. Um, but I, I, I just love a little bit more personality and that's why I do the decorative um, oversized lobsters. So it, it's part of that uh, beautiful detail and a personality piece. Okay, so don't forget about those uh, 16 inch, 20 inch, 32 inch, and 36 inches. 
Um, but remember, you can add two inches if you get the two inch rings or four inches to those lengths that um, I love to carry for you. Okay, so um, we, when you get it, we have a couple of questions. Uh -huh. Teresa Jory Stevenson was wondering if there's going to be a bracelet to go with the new pink purple set that's on the tree. Yes, Teresa, there is. And it, what it is, is it's this. That's why I brought this in. So there's, it's the, um, this, this, and this. This is what's in the multi. Ooh, that's, that's gonna be gorgeous. <laughs> okay, so a, a few of the pieces trickled in. I couldn't wait to show it. I had to because I've not had these amazing um, berry colors in a long time. And this is different from Xanadu. It's a little bit brighter um, berry tone to it um, than the Xanadu, but you can wear it with Xanadu, this one too. Um, so um, go ahead and uh, uh, call up the names That's, to yes, this. Yes, I was uh, just trying to find that way pure. they can see what's so going to be coming in the. We have pure bracelet. pink mystic topaz. That's this one. Okay. We have. Oh. That's this one. This the princess cut. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I don't. It says pink purple mystic quartz. Is that right? Oh. That doesn't that's, seem right. Oh no no no. no. I didn't think so. That's why I'm like. Oh mm, my I gosh! Think, how did I don't know catch you, that? I don't know. Oh no no no. no. There's like. Um, um, let me see. Let me no, see no, if I can. No it's not. Um. Mm -mm. Oh come on! Don't. Sorry about the pin it. Uh huh. Don't, uh, don't do, do that now. Don't do that now. Um. Okay. So you don't have any of them. On. So I, th this one is either pink vapor. And that one is pink vapor. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's the so pink the vapor. pink vapor because I have a bunch of pink vapor coming to mix in. Um, so there's a lot of really cool pink vapor things that are going to be coming. Um, but I wanted to do a really classic uh, pendant. These are the ones that you will just get a ton of use out of. And then I'll have a lot of other multi stuff that's going to go back to it. But look at this ring. Look at this ring. Oh my gosh, I, I just love this ring, ladies. It is, I, again, I really wanted to design something just really beautiful, unique, and different for you. <gasps> it's It feels so good on. Okay, I better take these off. But these little guys, these are great little um, stacker sets, though. I, I, you know, I love to have the hammered version because um, look how it balances out like a statement ring, too. And that ring we have a, is a, on Joe. Well, get a hold of Athena because it's okay. Seventy four ninety nine. I know what my stone is because this is one I used. The pear shaped stone is. This is one I used and I. Uh, no, I, it was at the same time that I used to use fairly impetuous, but it's not fairly. I'm impetuous. sure she has a message. Usually she hears that and she'll message me. <laughs> the um, okay, yeah. I'm just like no because it's. Uh, we have a question though. Uh, on the uh, from Teresa again, the cosmic skies. If you could show it next to the new pink purple set, she'd like to see how the cosmic sky looks oh. next to it. Yeah, because it has that burgundy that comes mm -hmm. out of it, right? Oh, I have it on my wrist. I could have taken the bracelet. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh my gosh, I could actually do this burgundy and the oh my gosh, the hot pink with it too, mm -hmm. right? Oh yeah. Oh no, I could definitely sneak a blue in there because you see how like sometimes the that cobalt will flash out of the mystics. Yeah. Yeah, that, I love those rings. I love doing the, the the really beautiful. This is my little signature band that I've used for three decades. So, like it's just that really great little low profile. Um, look at how this the bezel is set so that it curves around your finger, and look at this little cute guy. Right, I had to do some little filigree shoulders on him. Isn't he so cute? Mm -hmm. Another one that's going home with me. Double bezel, <laughs> double braid. Like this is my little signature uh, braid. That's like, it, ladies, you see my jewelry. Really, the the theme with getting that quality and that that certain um, that braid. Because if you compare other jewelry, other places, because it's not like I invented a braid but I invented a signature for myself, the quality of it, and um, really something that my team, that's that's why we use that, and you see that it will all kind of mesh back and coordinate with each other. So yes, there's gonna be a multi-bracelet then to go with this set here, um, and then this, but um, my goodness, just just look. Wait, I have another pink uh, vapor in a kush, a star, a star faceted, um, that I'm gonna be showing in the next couple weeks. 
Um, but yeah, just really, really unique. I don't have a bracelet coming for this one though. So that's just, it goes with the multi. It's kind of a standalone because I'll be using a lot of things. Um, but I wanted to kind of show you how it all matches back. If you've gotten Lucky Stone from me, how pretty the Heebie GV, uh, no, sorry, the Pink Vapor is, you will, you will find a Lucky Stone, which is four different uh, CZs, which is a cubic zirconia. So this is not lab created. This is what you would call simulated, right? A CZ. Um, and um, mixing back with the quartzes too. Um, but yeah, that, that is one of those sets you ladies have um, really, again, taken to. This Lucky Stone is gonna match so much of everything that, oh, what size did I do? I must have done a six. Um, so anyway, this, uh, oh yeah, see, look how pretty that would be, right? So the Lucky Stone bracelet is gonna fit a six to seven inch wrist. And we have a request for more size five rings. Oh, I, I'm sneaking a few in here, here and there for the, uh, on the smaller sizes. Um, but we did some fives and they didn't really move. So it's a lot of work to create a new like size on that. So that's why I was like, um, and a lot of my rings, if you're a five, you would buy a six for me. So are you saying you're a four and you actually buy a five for me? Uh, I'll throw that out to oh, someone say. who's uh, watching on YouTube. So oh, I'll yeah, yeah. Yeah, say. so if you're, if because most people will, uh, once, that's why I send the ring sizer out, uh, the thicker one, you will usually, if you're used to wear, buying just very small rings like this in size in your finger, you will probably, um, like if you're a six and a half, you're always going to be a seven with me, okay? Um, 100%. And then when I say, oh, if, if, uh, you usually buy sevens for me, size up and buy an eight. Um, so you always read the print before you check out on your size, ladies, um, because it will tell you um, if, if uh, what to do. But always know your base size for me. Once you get a ring uh, that's true to size, that I say is true to size, you'll pretty much consistently always get the same size for me. Someone says she is definitely a size five. She, that's her size. Okay. So. Well, no, no, she probably, it's just the thickness. But oh, she probably has rings for me then that are fives. Okay. I just didn't do a lot. That's why. The new pear shaped um, pink ring, you know, with the Janelle Adair band, mm -hmm. the new one. Uh, true to size? Which one? The new pear shaped pink. Yes, those by tr true to your Sarda size. Okay. And this one actually probably is true to like. You're, you're, you know, mm -hmm. when you do smaller rings or gold rings, you know, in, in that stature, yes, you would buy true to, to your size. But yeah, then that was one thing that I found when people started getting my collection is that maybe they buy different sizes and in, in different, oh, I love this ring. Man, I love this ring. <laughs> it's so pretty. I got to put the Roses from God bracelet. Oh, like that, that. I just love it because the quality of this bracelet is so the quality of this you know like i feel like the two quality bracelets like that just look so beautiful together because they are just so high end both of them the feel the fit everything about them is just the best the best of the best for the ladies out there you ladies i, I love telling you you're the best of the best because you are and i want you to i want you to own that claim that and we have two sizes in this bracelet. We have a six, seven, five yes. that will fit a six to a seven inch wrist. And we have a seven and a half fitting a six, seven, five all the way to a seven, seven, five on the wrist. Well, and this is lab created pink sapphire. So if you would test it with a gem tester, it's saying it's a real sapphire. You'd have to do other tests to know that it was grown in a lab. But here's the thing. We could never afford a sapphire this size ever. <laughs> um, yeah, it would be... Um, more than a house paint, right? Yeah. <laughs> so that's what is so beautiful about that is you can have different things, um, you know, and really, I mean, now you're even seeing with diamonds where most, a lot of the diamonds in the industry are lab created now. Diamonds now too, right? So um, love to do matching sets for you. So this is the full matching set here. It's the pendant, the bracelet, and the ring that I did in this. And in the past, I've done, you can actually go on and type in pink sapphire, uh, light pink sapphire, and dark rose sapphire. And I do a lot of different uh, sapphires. 
So it, once you know the color, you type that in, you'll see other things uh, with the same name that will match it exactly, okay? And this is the art of granulation work. We added additional layers over the top of the pieces um, that are all uh, applied and online by hand. So I love doing a few pieces like that where the, the granulation rolls over to the back. So you can just see that, that pendant is, so we, I have to put the gallery in first. So we put all the silver into the back and then we roll that over the top so that you just get this piece of art. Catherine Ferris said she just purchased the dark rose set and wore it for the first time the other day and received tons of compliments. <gasps> Oh my gosh, I love that. Oh my gosh. Well, pink too. I think this pink sapphire has made uh, some people into pink where they weren't into pink before too. Mm -hmm. Oh, by the way, ladies, guess what? It's on its way from Bali. The Love One Another bracelet. Oh. Three sizes. So really, I guess the other one was too close to it. And um, so the Love One Another bracelets, ladies, I'm gonna do a release. I'll give you a fair warning, okay? And I'm gonna get that really fine. Uh, this is a bracelet you can wear very fitted and it's amazing, but you can also wear it as a bangle. This is one of the only bracelets that I do that actually works as a bangle, fitted, roomy, relaxed. It, it just works. Um, and so in, in something like this, I have, uh, two different sizes that I wear because of that. You know, some days I like to wear it loose as a bangle. Some days I will wear a bracelet more fitted. So, I um, cannot wait. And then we'll have to see, of course, we'll, we're adding more sizes to everything, ladies. So, um, you just let me know. Um, I, the more feedback you can give me, the better. Uh, but what I'm basically doing right now, I have to look at what we're selling for sizes. And as those are going, that's how I'm adding new sizes, okay? Um, because it's, it's really hard to gauge. We've done all these different, uh, the, and now this is the one I just love because it's reversible. So if you're out and about, you, it, you can wear something just really fun and all silver, or you flip it over, see what the dimension of it, and you wear it as a gemstone pendant. So if you travel a bit, this is a great companion to have. Also too, because look at, look how, see how it just matches with so many, but we, my favorite gemstone is putting the praise your light with it. See how it pulls that green out? Isn't that just gorgeous? It's like the citrus like spa together. Mm -hmm. I really love is. it. Yeah, it's pretty. Okay, so what about the multis? Because yeah. this little guy, not Cal Sydney, Chris of Faze. I this one's gotta be sold out already. I I can't even super, super, super rare Chris of Faze. Okay. Um again out of my collection. I'm just like, it's so funny, I can't find the color. Like, I order the stone, design it, I don't like it. Mm -hmm. So I go in to my collection, <laughs> find the perfect shading to get these multis for you ladies. So anyway, it's, I'm gonna have nothing left here in a couple years. <laughs> <laughs> but um, yeah, oh no, how about if I show that one first? Because ladies, you're getting your praiseo light, okay? So you're getting your two praiseo lights. My, like, ladies, you know how, beautiful that is that green opal from australia okay and then the chrysophase okay which is just again like look at the look at the glow and the quality of this chrysophase and chrysophase is different than kale sydney you can look it up and you know it has different properties and stuff but um really there's like if you go to the big hong kong gem and jewelry show there's one person selling all the chrysophase he collects the best of the best and that's so rarely can I find some outside of this one person that pretty much dominates the chrysophase industry. So, um, yeah, pretty exciting. Yeah, that I don't know where he sits in Tucson. He might not come because it's literally that elite of a stone at this point. The bracelet, Janelle, is going to fit a 6.25 to an 8-inch wrist. And it's $229.99. I'm looking for that. Oh, I usually do my toggle this way. I always, I always do my toggle this way coming through like that. I don't. It's just the way that I know how to put them on. It's like once you get used to putting them on, they're just so easy, so easy. And yeah, no, I've seen a bunch of you ladies wearing them like this now too. So, and you can move it around however you want. And then um, this one, 
So again, this is one of my favorites, another Australian stone. It's rhyolite, or you, you hear it say rainforest jasper. Okay, and you see those really cool little patterns. What I love about this every once in a while, you'll see some clear quartz that will, that, like you'll see the little clear quartz on it. I put preaziolite with that. This is a bird's nest, another competition cut. And then my uh, personal stash collection of pre-night. This stone you cannot cut at all. You can't even put an order in for it. So whenever I find it, I buy whatever I can. I like I put my game face like you're not excited, you know. Like walk away just casually. Oh, okay. Oh, this is pretty. How much? So that <laughs> will fit all of it. <laughs> that will fit a six to a seven point seven five inch wrist. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, so this is the pendant that matches exact. So ladies, this is going to be the only one. This was uh, just a two piece collection. However, I do have some pre-night. There's probably six pieces left of the pre-night ring left, okay? That will go back. So this is a beautiful, um, beautiful ring. Very comfortable, true to size, okay? So you could do that. But don't forget, you've always got my praise your lights here too that are just so beautiful that will also play back to it, okay? Oh, yeah. Or you do both. <laughs> yeah, you do both because they're gonna, like all my colors will totally match. Um, then for this one, I did in this one, this is the only one. So you're only going to have this two stone pendant, okay? Or you're gonna have the praise your light one that goes with this bracelet, okay? So these are the only two pendants if you're a, a matchy person, which you will always probably not, maybe a lot of you ladies aren't, but as you start buying stuff from me, you'll start getting a little matchy matchy because the gemstones. Like, I always suggest getting at least two pieces because so many of the stones I use and some of these are just so unique, so rare, and come in their own kind of color shading. Um, the, yeah. The bracelet you just took off, the chrysophase, mm -hmm. did that fit you comfortably? The chrysophase. Terry was one. asking if the chrysophase bracelet. Yeah, I put it, I, I definitely used the first toggle. Oh yeah, this is my size. Yeah, see? Yep. Yep, this would be one of my sizes. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Yeah, these, I, my, my seven stone, I do not like them too fitted. I, I don't. Like, these are the ones where I do this. And I always, always, you're always gonna see me with a couple silver bangles. Um, but yeah, it's always gonna be, and actually I'm missing a tip to tip because I always do a tip to, did I not put a tip to tip on this show? <gasps> Just no the way. Wow, so I didn't. Like yeah, I'm always, I've got my silver tip to tips that I wear all the time because look at, it just creates just such a pretty, and at multi, you, you know me, I, I have my gray moonstone, my black spinel. Um, I try to get one that I'm not giving away. I still have not given that one away because it's like, that's just my look. It's just easy breezy. So um, otherwise I'd give, I, there's just a few pieces I'm like, you know, just keep it. It's not that they're even the most rare. It's just, I just love it. Now this little bangle is one of my favorite little bangles that I've designed. I always say get two, these really, because it's reversible. You've got this look, which is that domed filigree, really hard to achieve, okay? That's why I love this one. I love that it's one of the smaller petite ones and that we have that retention hinge on it, but we have the, the magnet in it too. So it's that busy girl bracelet. Then you're getting that really beautiful structured filigree on the side, but you're getting that really contemporary um, flat jaw one. So see how cool it is? Like it's just a different look, you know, in a stack. And or we have you two sizes in that one too, you know. Do this. We have a six seven five fitting a five and a half to a six seven five wrist and a seven and a quarter that's gonna fit a six point seven five to a seven point two five wrist. Cool. Yeah, oh, and you have them for ninety nine dollars. Oh, and look at this beaded. Like I, I, I know so many of you ladies already have the multi uh, agate. I mean, I think it's just so cool. This, it, it's so crazy how much that goes with, right? With the bright mm -hmm. pink, mm -hmm. how it goes with blues. Right? Sleeping Beauty turquoises. It's so cool with too. Um, and don't forget, this is that courage. Yep. 
my it's that serenity prayer and for me courage is like something I pray for because for me I have a lot you know I was born with a lot of fear and anxiety and I ask for that courage every day so this to me are those giftable rings because anymore ladies I can't it, it it's getting to where the price for my artisans to do multi cases it's getting harder and harder um, just because of all the labor that they do and I want to make sure that they're honored in everything that they do so um, this is super old pricing still um, but all of that is inlaid on the inside but I just think it's kind of cool because even if you just keep two and you gift one to one of your friends your sister your mom I, I just think it's or what I do is I always stack up extra ones. Sometimes I'll wear two of the same bracelet because then I, I, always, I just, I love that. I love that connection with uh, the women and friends that I have. Okay. And you so, did a great deal on that too. Seventy four ninety nine for all three rings. Mm, and then before you move on, mm -hmm. I have a request to see the earrings and the pendant in the pink vapor, please. Oh, sure. Yeah, I just flipped those really quick because I was hoping to save them for the when the multi bracelet well, comes. Teresa Joy Stevens. Oh, Teresa. Yes, of course. What's no, Teresa. I will always. I, no, I will sh always show everything. But I was like, that bracelet. I'm like, uh, I had to keep redoing that bracelet. Like sometimes I didn't like the positioning of the gemstone, so I changed it. Now, Teresa, I also have. Yeah, Teresa, the, the colors on these are just amazing. Yeah, no, so this is totally right up her alley. The mm -hmm. cushion, the other one, because she, she does more statement kind of pieces too, but the other one I'm doing is in the Love One Another Janelle Adair style. And the other collection I'm going to be bringing in next week. Is it next week? I think. Yeah, it doesn't go with this one. These are all just those pockets that... What happens, I designed something, I don't like the color, so I've ended up taking some of my stock, creating a collection where I love the colors for you, but then I can't reorder it because it's stone that I've been having. They discontinued things. I can't get the rough to match um, to get enough. So um, you will find that I love to do things like that. It's not sane to do a lot of those, but that's my team is so used to that in Bali. They, they, they love doing new things and challenges, so I'm very blessed uh, to be able to do those. Okay, and did you ask me to do something? Uh, no, but I am now. Oh, okay. Brandy Hahn. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I forgot something again. Uh, Brandy Hahn was wondering if you're going to be making a rainforest jasper ring to go with the rainforest. I know, but you know what? Oh my gosh. Jess, we have all that rough that I've got sitting over there. I'm going to have to cut some up. Okay. We need a lot more rainforest, Jeff. Oh, oh here's, the, um, here's the problem. It's really hard to get consistency in the stones. So these are kind of a weird little phenomenon where I was able to perfectly match them up. Rhyolite rainforest jasper is really hard because sometimes there's blue, uh, kind of browns and yellows to it. And sometimes there's the greens and the whites, which I really, really love that patterning better so um okay i don't need to do another collection i have nothing planned the whole year <laughs> brandy you're spot on i need to do it okay so Teresa said she also didn't get to see the pear-shaped pink as well i guess we with the when we were, realized there was a oh the pear-shaped pink yeah oh that um these guys yes i don't think i showed the one stone so if you want the one stone instead, in the one stone, is that the right one? Yes. Yes, yes I think that's Are you sure? One. Okay. Yeah, or, Teresa, you do the, the pink like this too. I didn't do earrings in this. Um, I did do a ring though. Um, because I'm doing, um, some other things that this is gonna kind of really kind of match back with, but this is super limited. I don't have a lot of stuff coming in the shade. Um, however, my Hayward Muse looks gorgeous with it. So I might have to, that's why I'm like, no, I know I looked up this name because I think um, it's really pretty with the Hayward. So as I was playing with stuff, so yeah. Well, 
And then later, and I can't believe sorry, that can't remember Jenna, that name. lots of questions. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, 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 no please. Keep, keep, keep them coming. Me. Keep them coming. Linda Ricardo was asking if she could see the Praseolite green opal chrysophase multi stone bracelet again. Praseolite, sure. Oh, yeah, because these are on Jodo. So, ladies, mm -hmm. you want to get them on Jodo because they'll the, then they'll they'll go back to 40% off, which they're still a great deal at 40% off. Are you kidding? Uh, but the multis, I give you the biggest discount at Jodo because, like, I hand match up every stone together like four chrysophases i have to be honest are really this the, the color shading of the pre, the chrysophase is really hard okay so i i don't know that's i i, I just love when, when you see these small pockets like this i'm i'm doing i'm doing it <laughs> on all the pocket collections so um what else did you have oh okay okay okay, okay. I'm like, yes, ladies, keep uh, referencing back, and uh, Michelle will tell me where to go back if I forgot something, okay? Um, loving this. This was on the other tray, just so you know, the green tray. I had too much because it all looked really good together, so it was kind of crazy. Um, really loving the Prazio lights and stuff with a lot of these collections and stuff, too. So even with these colors here, so it was kind of one of the ones where I had the green in the middle, and it kind of went into this because I, I even for this I thought it was so pretty together, right? Um, so if you're doing the emeralds and the Prezio lights, oh, yeah. loving the mm -hmm. this uh, Chrysocolla Sonora with the Prezio lights too. Um, yeah, I was kind of having fun. That's why this tray got totally out of control. <laughs> um, oh, is that yeah? This this one is my size, um, but. One of my favorite statement rings, like uh, this shape of, I want to bring other gemstones in this one because it is so comfortable, so comfortable. It just, it, I just love it on this finger. It is just snuggy. Like it, oh, it just feels so good. But yeah, kind of into those. This is kind of cool because the Christmas Cola Sonora is kind of like this greenish blue. It's, it's kind of neutral. It tends to kind of go back with a lot of kind of cool things. Um, I can't wait to see actually what you ladies are combining all that with too. But it's um, I, the red coral. Look how cool it is with the red coral too, right? See, I'd probably do something like this. Like when I do, I'd probably bring that. Oh, here, let me take this guy off here. Where did he go? Um, I'd probably do this kind of thing. And I would stack up my wrist with bracelets over here. Let me go. I didn't bring enough of my silver bracelets. Like, yeah. what is going on here? Okay, I'm going to have to do this because these are key to have silver bracelets that you can use. So, yeah, here we go. We're like this. The Chrysocolla uh, Sonora ring, true to size, Chanel? No. Yes, yes. This one you do not have to size up. No. So, sometimes I like to kind of mix up like this and wear them on the different hands like this. You know? So, that's see how pretty like how fun that would be mixing that, that nice. up right mm -hmm. and i'm going to be like i said doing a lot more coral but i love this ring so much that i actually did this one of this show only for you ladies you because did. it is just a spectacular ring it's just spectacular and see even for me i thought how fun would that be to throw in like a red bead then too with it like this oh i'd maybe stick my uh my and the, my Hayward Muse too that's going to be coming up um, is going to be so so pretty with that too, but yeah this is going to be one of those stones that you're going to find so much that will go back with it. I'd maybe even stick in one of my black spinel bracelets or something you know. But really mixing your color, you're going to be shocked at how much, like you're putting your jewelry on and going, oh my gosh, I think my Chrysocolla Sonora actually looks good with it. Yeah, and red coral ring on the show special $69.99 and I did a full collection but when I brought it back these are your only two pieces you need that's it and that was my next question is there a pendant coming <laughs> nope I, I oh no I did it at one time but when I went to bring it back for the reorder I made it second size in the bracelet um but yeah the pendant um maybe when I bring I do a multi stone but to me I liked bringing in like a big black spinel, a labradorite. Labradorite looks really cool with the two. Um, something a little bit different, 
Like, to me, this is just such an art. Like, it's almost like it's a canvas. Somebody, like, just started painting, like, a sunset to it, you know? Like, they're just, it, I don't know. It's, um, the colors are just so beyond perfect together, but at the same time, they're just very at the different spectrums, right? But they, they just work. They do. And they look do. at the ruby. Look at, and I'm gonna be bringing a ton of ruby too. So you mix your rubies in with that too. So pretty, right? Mm -hmm. So um, don't forget your rubies because your rubies go with your corals too oh, and all so your good. things too. Um, but, I, you see I've been quiet about this, okay. So <laughs> you know I, t I took all my stones and cut the eight by sixes all my rough left okay this was what i literally was not going to share but i did it anyway ladies do you see these monsters this is in the Mad red madeira citrine clothes like like go like these are must-haves okay so look how big they are and this is the rest of what i'm, I'm having which are still beautiful right but the, these amazing and so I had to stick it with the amylite and there should probably not be bracelets left because this Jodo price on it mm, I know two forty nine ninety nine. So look how good this is together and that's gonna fit a six to a seven and a half inch wrist that is amazing and this is gonna fit a lot of you ladies out there too like size wise, mm -hmm. ooh, see, and this is where it's like, oh my gosh, look at that. I'm gonna bring the rich cherries in with that one. Like, ooh, oh, yeah. it, like even like, you know, oh, so pretty. But yes, so I am so excited. So that is it there. I don't have even one I'm hiding, ladies. I used every single piece I had left to do these guys right here for you, okay? Um, you ladies that are getting the, the Madeira from me, uh, but I had to do uh, the eight by sixes. You'll see a bunch of things. I wanted to do just that really cute uh, close up to your neck wear with um, the chain. So I got as small as I could on this one because to me, maybe you just want a small pop and see the difference between the ruby and the red Madeira. I wish, you know what would be cool is if I had Hessonite garnet, Ooh. red Madeira, ruby, so I could show you like there's different feels and colors that but there is this warm glow, um, just this warmth that just with, with this Madeira is so special. It will be something I talk about the rest of my life, like that, you know, I found this material because again, it's not going to be coming around anymore. So Madeira Citrine Bracelet is going to fit a five all the way up to a seven two five wrist, the Lynn Bluer. Look at this one. <laughs> oh yeah, see? This would be good for her. Oh my gosh, this one? Yeah, mm -hmm. that little three stone one. Look at that. Mm -hmm. See, I couldn't. Uh, yep, that one's gonna be perfect for you. And that one's on Jota one twenty nine ninety nine. Janelle, oh, I know for the Madeira yeah. Citrine. Well, yeah. and those will only be able to hit one Jodo because, um, I, like I said, my stones were getting down there. But I always love. Oh my gosh, see the Chrysocolla Sonora again. But you're gonna get this glow out of the red Madeira. And here's the thing, I'm getting down to the red and it will start to go into more of the, um, the cognac color. Um, so the, the red is just, like I said, I cut up the rest of it, singling out the red. So I'll try to do the red as long as I can, but then it's gonna go to the, the golden Madeira, okay? And are both of the uh, Madeira citrine rings true to size? Uh, this one, I believe I said size up, sorry. Did you know what I this one was not supposed to be shown? But when I did this downstairs, size up on this this okay. this one was that. I don't have it on there. So you know I'll why this it. was not supposed to come <laughs> in? It, it, it literally it came in. I'm so sorry, ladies. This one you're gonna size up a size, okay? We'll get that adjusted. And this one true to size, okay? Because this one, the way that I design it with the overlap, and I do such a beautiful gallery on this one that it's literally. You're in between sizes, it's gonna, yeah. See, I'm an eight, this is an eight, but these, you, you'll want extra space, and trust me, I, I designed them so that they're gonna work for you, okay? 
Yeah, most of you ladies will find that sometimes you can wear two different sizes for me, right? Um, on the same finger. Yep. It's because I do that really amazing uh, customization. You know, really these custom galleries. Every one is different. Every size is different. Um, yeah, I, I'd love that for you. Oh my gosh, isn't this so pretty though too? Look at this one. Like, I love this. These, that's why I want, I put this one out here. Isn't that, look how pretty those oh, are together. Oh, that looks good. Aren't those so pretty I together? I love this little ring. Actually, we've got to get him on reorder. Um, I, there's a couple sizes missing, and I hope we have your size. So I'm hoping to get him by the end of the year reordered. He is just, oh. And besides, he goes with everything, right? Mm -hmm. All my filigree bracelets, all I'm, my tree of life, yeah. everything. You I know? like him with the reversible bracelet. He looks good with that one, too. But, okay, so that's, you know, for my ladies that like this size, okay? But then for, like, ladies like myself, you're going to do this. This is your look. <laughs> okay, so you're going to go full on. Got to have that signet ring. Have to. Nikki Lee is asking that red citrine is so beautiful. Is that a natural color? Yes. No, this is. Yeah. Oh, now, just so you know, citrine, every citrine, um, every quartz, amethyst, uh, it's heat treated. It has to be even white quartz. Okay, so... There's, you know what they say that all stones have some treatment. So anything you're getting, it's not just special to my life. It is. There will always be heat treatment to every quartz citrine. Praise your lights, you know. So, yes. So it would still have to be under the category as a treated stone. Okay. And then while you're out here, we have a few questions. Oh, yeah, yeah. Shirley McCullough was oh, asking what... coffee. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, questions. What, okay. What earrings would you wear with the Chrysocolla suite? Okay. Um, what you doing? I know that I've mixed the emerald rings with it. Um, I, To be honest, I'd probably do an all silver or I would wear my black spinel because you always get that in it. So um, that would be my style though. Um, other things, like you could definitely, like if you're mixing the red coral though, you're doing the red coral with it. Um, you could do the, yeah, you could wear, cause you're doing this, mm -hmm. the red, right? I like it, and then you could get that red ring too. I think oh, I've got a little pair of red Madeira earrings coming in too. Oh. Did I not do earrings? How could I have not done earrings? You had two <gasps> I feel like I don't know. I think the cost because they were getting there. I thought, oh, is it worth it for the ladies? Mm. I know I'm always thinking like cost, even though I mark everything down super cheap anyway. But I don't. I thought the coral was really pretty. No more oh. editing. Just do it, Janelle. <laughs> okay, what other question? Uh, Jennifer Flesar was wondering if it. Amaline has brown in it. She's trying to see if there's Am any Oh, brown. yeah. There's always an undertone. Oh, sorry. I haven't shown you this. There's always an undertone of brown when you turn it one way. So there'll be brown, and then when you move it, it flashes the color. So, yes, there will always be a flash, but when you move it, then it turns to a color. It's just kind of cool like mm -hmm. that. So it, it will flash a brown, but then... See, as you move it, it flashes to a color. See? Mm -hmm. Yeah, That's it's beautiful. it's the most like amazing thing. You'll sit there and just play with your ring forever. Like you'll be like, oh wow, look at this way, this way, this way. So the yeah, ring. they're just incredible. Oh, sorry, let me show you all that because you're like, excuse me, Janelle, could you please show us the ring? Because it's on Jodo. It is. And it's an amazing price. One twenty nine ninety nine. Oh, I gotta show that, ladies. Have you gotten that? This is an amazing. This is one of my tree of life rings. I love, I love this little ring. Mm -hmm. I didn't grab that for myself yet. Woo. Okay, so see, yeah, you'll you'll see those those colors change. Okay, in the amylite. Okay. So. Um, and then the matching amylite. Yep, matching pendant is one nineteen ninety nine. And this is not a reasonable like price for like. Are you kidding? My analytes have always like really gone to almost over 200 now. So these Jodo prices are when you you get it when you buy is Jodo, okay? Because um, 
literally, I cannot bring things back at Jodo again. I, it, I really want to keep showing up here with you ladies and having fun. So um, I am really having to kind of have to stick to that. Um, and if I don't, then we have to go back to where it's only for the day. <laughs> and everybody needs the rest of the week for it. So I, I, like, I'm somebody who always does what I say that I'm going to do as far as, but sometimes that's the problem with other people sometimes though, then I don't, I'm not as good. So I'm like, my intention is there, but I, I'm just like, oh, but, oh, somebody didn't get to, oh, it was their payday or they were sitting. Yeah. They need, need us to keep it up till Thursday. <laughs> so as soon as I hear that, it's like, okay, that's it. We always gotta do what you need, so. And okay. We have a request to see the red beads up close. Oh yes, yes. Okay, now the, these. The red bead necklace. Oh, actually these. Do you know that this actually went really pretty with this too? See, I took it off the tray, but man, it was. Oh no, it doesn't look good under here though. Why did it look good over here? Oh, I don't like that with that. No, what? This is showing more pink. Looks good from here with the core. Oh, I like the, actually, you know what? I, I think ruby, I did it with the, with the I, ruby. I think it, yeah, I think it was the ruby. Because we didn't have a pendant, I think it was That's like the That's what it was. I'm like, what did I match? You're right. No, it's mm -hmm. the ruby. Mm -hmm. See, because it has that pinkish. Yeah, the ruby jade, imperial jasper, and mus muscovite. Actually, I like it with the red, too. Or yeah, it looks good with actually, the red, Actually, no, it's good, really good with the red, too, though. Oh, this has got that really cool little magnet enhancer on it too. See, boom. See, mixing. You're gonna find like once you start getting things from me, because I kind of tend to follow this like flavor that other gemstones I get from you will kind of match with some of the other things that I that I do. Um, I'm a granule um, designer, so like it, there's always gonna be other things that you get that's going to match. This is such a cute little ring. You know I've yeah. done this in other colors because of it. I think I think we should have gone the Ethiopian opal. I think I please tell me we put that in. I'm always seeing that. Reverb. And the uh, we have a request. The BDS number for the necklace is BDS one three seven. And then we have matching bracelets BDS one three eight and one three nine for that. For a hinge. The, um, oh, this one's so cute. These little uh, bracelets, oh my gosh, what other stones do we, we need this and just everything. They're so, per I did them in pearl too. Um, they're so perfect. Okay, so that is everything on here because that was, <gasps> okay, ladies, are you ready? Oh my gosh, wait, wait, I gotta, I gotta put this uh, to where I can show it. Okay, <gasps> okay. Look at the elephants, look at the elephants. <laughs> ladies I did this so all your elephant jewelry for me you'll have some other series of stuff that you have now and if you got this bracelet remember I had this how beautiful is that bracelet right oh my gosh yes um look at the ring look how cute the ring is the ring is so look at this it just looks like a, it, like something beautiful, and then you realize, oh my gosh, no, they're elephants. That's so cute. Isn't that so sweet? Oh my gosh, I just love this. <laughs> and you see, I did the same kind of patterns as the the bat gallery on the uh, the um, the original, the not the colossal elephant, but this the other one. And then look at. Look at how cute. Aren't these darling? Oh my gosh. And I wanted to do just a really beautiful filigree base on those two. Oh, they're so cute. Oh, I better measure on these. Uh, Cause they're not as large as I go usually. It's, it's kind of a medium size for me. And um, just so you know, I'm getting a tip to tip bracelet with the stones on the top. I didn't do elephants on them, okay? Because the elephant bracelet I designed was quite large, and I thought, you know what? I kind of like the colossal t uh, tip to tip bracelet in the elephant and all silver, and then bringing in the tip to tip with the tree of life filigree 
together, wearing those together. So um, that is, I had to do multiple sizes in the bracelet, so it's it's kind of uh, delayed a little bit, uh, but it will be coming. Uh, and look at how pretty too, oh my gosh, with all your mother of pearl mosaic that you have too. So pretty, right? Mm -hmm. That you can mix along with it, something really fun. So the elephant, he is on Jodo too. So his, yeah, he's bringing yeah, him. Pendant $89.99, ring $69.99, earring $89.99. Oh, now look at, he is so beautiful with the Australian um, pink opal. Um, yeah, I mean, oh, and that ladies, the peach moonstone. Yeah, I was just going to say, I and think it has the moonstone. Your Coonsight uh, Quartz, remember, I, I these will be pockets. None of these can be reordered with the pink, um, unfortunately. But, um, oh my gosh, ladies, remember that really cool ring that I designed? Uh, remember it's on a reorder, the watermark? I did the same kind of cool twisty torsage to this one. Is that cool or what? So that's gonna go with this. And all that peach moonstone, I forgot to bring, we have some Christian Square peach moonstone. Uh, go to my uh, website, put in peach moonstone. You're gonna see a bunch of other things that we just showed, what, last, last week? week. Mm -hmm. That's gonna coordinate with this because I would 100% be the peach girl. But I do have a couple pieces on this tray too though. Uh, but oh my gosh, this one is so neutral and oh my gosh, I have this uh, champagne uh, pearl too that's going to combine into this Ooh, also. Yeah. Like this is such a beautiful neutral. Like if you're not, oh my Hayward News colors, like you're going to be able to match those back to this. Um, I, I love gorgeous opaque stone that has multiple colors kind of running through it. Um, something with personality. Um, but. And that bracelet's gonna fit a six to a seven and a half inch wrist, you know. Oh, look at that. Pendant ninety nine ninety nine for six three and a six. Yeah, to a seven. Okay. Hey Tanya, will you try this on? Yeah. And so the three stone pendant ninety nine ninety nine. I feel like six usually it's a quarter inch though. I just want to make sure you probably hook into the last one if you did. Okay. But here's the option. You get that or you do a one stone pendant. I think it is. I just got to. And Sheila was asking what is the large center stone? That's a pink opal, correct? This is the pink opal. Mm -hmm. This is from Australia also. Um, they'll also sometimes there's pink mukite that runs through this also with, in, with the pink opal. So there is what it fits. It's even a little bit. It does fit you. Yeah. Okay, can you change that? Because I'm like, mm -mm, my multis, it's never just one inch. Well, I have it to a seven and a half. Oh, I'm, I thought you said seven. Oh, okay. If I did, I misspoke. <laughs> okay, no, I was going to say, mm -mm. it's always usually an inch and a half, like the, the adjustability on those. Mm -hmm. So that is so cool. So this is going to, I don't, I have the only the small amount of the peach moonstone left if you want a square on the website, but there's like four rings left, three earrings, like very, but I did this really cute, this one, the brie shaded mukai goes with the other peach. I told you I'm doing peach, ladies, this peach is so amazing. This is, I have to order, I can't, I, like whatever she makes me, that's it. They will always be pocket collections, I'll never be able to like, um, and the shading will always change. So these all match right now per collection. But if I were to do a reorder, I can never get them matched up, okay? So I would definitely suggest if you're getting two pieces, get them together, oh, okay? Oh, so pretty. I love this pendant. Oh, me too. I love him. He's so cute. He's so tiny, right? So I love it. Sorry, my nails so are like, I was cooking today and it's like, <laughs> I should have scrubbed my nails after. Sorry, sorry ladies, please ignore that. $59.99 on the pendant and $54.99 on the Michelle future ring. See, I, I know, <laughs> see this is your like cup know, of tea, right? And the I colors, <laughs> but can you see this new, like I have to do this in much, much more. Do you see this, the band? Mm -hmm. Ladies, remember I told you that was going to be something I'd be doing a lot more of. So I've got a bunch of bracelets that will go back to this that I did in that design. I love this. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm going to have to pull this one because I need way, way more of this one. 
Um, yeah, it, these are just great because I wear all my statement rings. So when I wear my statement rings, I need a bunch of these to just kind of center off my hands sometimes, okay? Because sometimes I can't always go all big ones because then they don't fit and too much clinking. I, these are just perfect enough where it's like it balances it, right? Mm -hmm. So I needed these myself, ladies, so I know you do too because it's like I designed for myself and for you. So these you will love. Okay, this one, the reason I can't do this one, um, again, on, on this bracelet, is the um this this guy right here is the most incredible so he is a natural um titian shell pearl shell but it was this luminosity of this pink it was so pretty that i did a quartz natural quartz on the top of it okay Never going to match these up or find these again because the color hues that I found in them were so unusual. So I cut the material and I've been sitting on it for 10 years, yeah. Um, so finally, the Brachiated Moo Kite, which is one of my favorite materials, um, I did this little pocket collection for you. So this is gonna be super uh, limited. Like, yeah, I won't be able to redo it, but it's it's just super special. Look how cute he is. Look at, remember my my stud that I did? Remember the ball oh, yeah. earring? Remember the bracelet I'm showing next week, the tip to tip? There it is. It's gonna tie back. And how perfect is this? Let me see. Sorry, I'm just like, love, I'm so excited about these pockets. Um, see, Peach? This is the Tahitian Mother of Pearl, but it, it, the shading, we, it, know, is we, that incredible? I had to window box it. We have it as Champagne Mother of Pearl. So if they want to search for Oh, yes. Champagne. Sorry. Thank you. Because, yeah. Mm -hmm. And it does, if you have the Champagne Pearl, they all look so pretty together. Are you kidding? Mm -hmm. They're all really pretty. Okay. So the only one that I've got matching here, okay, but you could do a one stone also. And whoever's buying the bracelet, you will be getting yours matched first. And then the remaining of people who are just buying individual pieces. So you multi bracelet ladies, the first night, uh, it's always guaranteed I'm matching your stuff for you. Okay, because I match them when I design them all. But then, um, yeah, it's important when uh, the sets are coming through. So I. But it, it's also my personal taste of like, okay, this combines with this. So you could get home. It, it, it's never going to hurt my feelings if you're like, oh, I, I, yeah. No, you're going to love it. No, you're going <laughs> to love it. Never mind. You're going to love it because like, yeah. I know it's like, yeah. Oh, this, is this incredible? Okay, you know what's more incredible? <laughs> and this is why I had this on the same tray was because of the praiseo light. Do you see the greens that pick up? I love Did you see that. how elevated that went? Yeah, that mm. gemstone, yeah. like gem poria here. The, I, I, I'm in the land, I don't wanna leave. The main <laughs> bracelet, one ninety nine ninety nine. The three stone pendant the is ninety nine ninety nine, and the single stone pendant is sixty nine ninety nine. These okay. natural stones are just my favorite, but they're really hard to work with and cut, but so pretty. Oh, I forgot. I, um, you ladies were asking about my, uh, this is my collection I designed for my mom. It's the breast cancer awareness or the memory with ribbon. Um, my mom's a survivor. And so anybody that's a survivor out there, it's, um, I want you to be big and bold about it who you are and what God did in your life. And this, this is it. Pretty incredible, right? The work. My mom That's wore this on Mother's Day. Oh. Yeah. To, when we all met up. Oh, it was such a great day. My mom's like, it was the best day I've had ever. I'm like, she's so funny. I'm like, ever. <laughs> I love it. Yeah. No, it was pretty, pretty awesome. And then, uh, of course, the matching ring. You know, I always say Gotta have at least two pieces, okay? It was so funny because back then the pink was a lot darker, the one. Mm. Now, what I did is I ended up doing dark and light tones so it matched with more. Or before it was just hot pink. Now you get 
a little bit of hot pink, but you get really neutral pinks that match back to so much of the other stuff that I do, right? Because again, you know, you'll have different pieces for me. Like, see where this kind of collection is, the yellows, that, that's what's so special about this, the two shades, you're getting the pinkish and the yellowy um, greens to it. That's gorgeous. So pretty. Okay, so these are two other pieces that I've had also two. okay? So these are other ones. And the reason I wanted to bring this out is next week, I am going to have Citrine that's going to bring all of these stories together, okay? In the hexagon that I told you, I took my material, recut it, okay? Because there's no Citrine in the market. And I want you to look at, look at the brilliant cut on that. Wow. Okay, so this is so cool. So it's gonna tie back, but I'm going to have, and I know, why did I do that? Because it's, but it's gonna be at Jodo. So you're going to want to get it at Jodo. Cause when it goes back, I did five citrines in a bracelet with the chain links. Okay, all citrine, five stones. I'm doing a ring, which is a three band ring. That is so cool. It's one of my favorite three band rings in the chain link. And I made it into a, a, the gemstone one. It's the ring you see me wearing all the time. I didn't put it on here. Why didn't I put it on here? Oh, maybe because I was, I was supposed to show the citrine tonight, but we didn't get it done. It was, it was, it was, it was a long day. It's right guys. Are you sleeping over there? Are you sleeping over there? No, we're just moving <laughs> on over next. <laughs> okay, so okay, so here you go. Chain link. I gotta go into my silver though, okay? And then we'll move on because it is so important to have your really great silver pieces, okay? And ladies, I did a size uh, fill, okay? So I rushed, this was one of the most popular silver rings we did okay and it's a fill on the sizes so if we ran out of your size you need to run run because i filled in your size that sold out okay so this is that stack system that i did for you look how perfect and beautiful that is this is the ring you see me wearing all the time on my pinky you see me wearing it here i have multiple sizes in this the little cute little cross Oh, I like that one. And then, right? Full, full. So, these. So, this is, yeah, a stack system. So, get true to size if you're going to break them apart like this. Um, if you're wearing them together, you might want to go up. See where it goes a little thicker? So if you're gonna wear all three together, go up a size. Otherwise, like me, I this is like this is such a cute little standalone ring like this. Yeah, you need little rings like this all the time. Mm -hmm. So I'd even suggest getting like if you if I think we start this at a size six though, but we're we're, we're bringing this ring in in midi sizes because it's my favorite ring. So this will be coming in uh, two, three, four five soon just this ring alone this one i think also because i just love it so much but the stack system is cheaper when you get three and i gotta tell you this is a great little piece right here i like that one too yeah, yeah it's really awesome so probably best stack system i've done it in a long time 71.99 for all three rings you know yeah so pr pretty awesome pretty awesome yeah this this ring alone would be a lot just for that one Okay, and okay, now let's talk about a great, awesome, awesome statement ring with personality, shape. Trey, I think I called you in on this one before. I think it's a great guy's ring, but no, women. <gasps> this is, it, it is, it's just luxury, luxury, luxury. Ladies, it's the shape of it is just very contemporary. This is your classic forever piece. And uh, true to size, you can get true to size on this. But it is, it's just an amazing ring. It, it, did it say true to size? Because it does, I want to make yes, sure that I didn't pull it. It does nine. not say the size. Yeah, so. okay. I just want to make sure because sometimes it's like, wait, when I pulled that. Um, I 
sized up on it just to make sure like I did a special fitting. So like I could never sell this to a store because I know this is the size you need because of the width. And I didn't want you to have to size up a whole size. I just wanted you to get home and go, oh, okay, why do I love wearing this ring so much? Just really beautiful, beautiful quality. And that's where I put my little statement bracelet, which is just awesome. I have two sizes in it. We do. We have so this is really a generous size, which ladies, I'm telling you, jump on it. I'm, I'm, I'm doing some really, the price on this, yeah. crazy good. 228 and that uh, larger size will fit all the way up to an eight, it'll fit a 725 all the way up to an 825 Janelle. So there again, shout out to the eight inch wrist ladies, right? Mm -hmm. And then we have a size seven fitting a six to seven inch wrist. Yeah, I love this. It's just, just a really cool statement piece, you know, so pretty. Okay, so that is, oh, wait, 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 wait. my earrings, okay. These, we, we all need these, you know why? This is that bracelet you ladies ask me about all the time, okay? This is the one that I'm always wearing that you're asking me about. And I have also the style that has all the chain link all the way around. Um, this gets silkier and silkier as you wear it too, ladies. It's such a beautiful little bracelet. And um, so funny. It's like one of the easiest braces to get on. I'm struggling with it. Okay, I'm like, okay, that's great. Okay, so, yes, easy, easy. To me, just classic, cool looking when you like, you look at somebody's wrist and then you're like, oh, those earrings go back. So I had to do the earrings out of this show only to really get, for the two pieces, so affordable, ladies. But I would highly suggest, these are the ones you get together and it fits so so many people. Trey, Trey, mm. wait a minute. What's the size? Is he needs an eight. He needs an eight. It goes to a seven six to a seven seven five. Oh no, he's gonna have an eight. Yeah, Tom he needs Z. an eight. Okay. And then the show special. I gotta do another size for that. <laughs> you know, the show special on the earrings fifty nine ninety nine. Yeah, that's why I had to do those together to try to get because to me those two like really. And I would do this this and this little set like just classic mix in with all your gemstone stuff so perfect then i think you have some oh the funky ones, ones. yeah <gasps> yes okay ladies you asked to see them back okay so yes these are so cool i've got to put these in oh i have my diamonds in yeah uh, for you know uh my sister's best friend these are the ones that i made that i wear all the time so i don't give earrings away uh, but ever since covid like I'm a little bit like I wouldn't give the earrings anymore, but I had to make something so I quit giving earrings out of my ears. Mm -hmm. Okay, but my sister has them. I made it for Carrie, her best friend. This is still her best friend, her sister. My sister has a pair. Yeah, so. I know she does. Yeah, so it's like, um, yeah, it was, it was that thing where, so we, my sister never takes hers out, either does Carrie. Oh, and Carrie works at a either. fine, fine jewelry store, so she, that's all she wears. So these are just really cool, funky. Oh, I, I couldn't remember, did I put it, the short one towards my face or the other way? I thought we did it, oh. Was it the other way? So either way you choose, you can wear it like this or you can wear it with the long and the short going out. Mm -hmm. I think I'd wear it like this way, the yeah, short going out. I think that's what we Just did. the way I designed, I think I would do that. Uh, Becky says but long no wrong side way. inside to the face. So you wear the long, what you just said, the short out. The, the second. The piece. short, yes. yes so short I out. do, I have them. Yep, 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 yep. See, because yes. to me, it was like, that's, it just looks yeah. better a certain way. She received hers last week and that's how she wears them. Short, long to the face. Yeah, long to the face. Yes. Becky? Becky Wafer. Uh, Becky. She got I hers. love it. Ooh, you got some itchy cool ones. I know we, this like, she picked some great classic things too, and mm -hmm. it's fun. I'd love to hear when you get some edgy things too. Yeah, these are just, yeah. This is like, I still got it. Look at, I'm a trendsetter. <laughs> we gotta buy ourselves some stuff like this every once in a while. So yeah, they're just, to me, it's just gonna be that pair where you need just that finishing touch, something a little different. Um, 
It's it. And then the pear shaped, the new pear shaped pink set. Mm -hmm. um, we had questions if that would match um, B pink. Oh, the B pink. No, the B pink is very red. Mm -hmm. Um, this one, no. It's not Xanadu. It's not fairly impetuous. I just can't even believe the. I remember at the time going, that should not be that. Oh, is it forgetful? Oh. Forgetful? Maybe. That would make sense. <laughs> Savannah, Wouldn't that be funny? <laughs> Wouldn't that would be hilarious. Right? Yeah, and, Janelle. <laughs> and then Simona was wondering uh -huh. if the pink opal changes color over time. Hers changed color? No, does it? Oh! <laughs> does it change like color what? over time? <clears throat> No, this is an uh, opaque stone that comes out of the ground like this. So, no, this is going to stay the same. And Roseanne is asking if you will me. ever make the piece pendant again. And I think we have that. Oh, wait. No, we've if got we that. that no, no, that. we still have some. Yeah. yeah, we still have the piece pendant. Yeah. Yeah. So, actually, I think I just actually came upon it and went, I've got to plan in it. I have so many different things to plan in. And um, we haven't shown it for a while, so I think we better we, bring yeah. the piece back. Yeah. yeah, we'll bring that in. Or and just put it on the website. Can somebody move it over and put up special? Can. Okay. You know what? I'll tell you what. Seventy nine ninety nine. Just put a price on it. Okay. Seventy nine ninety nine. Just yes, just for to, uh, just for tonight. Okay. Okay. Because I think I was supposed to have a higher price on that. Just tonight. One day only. Big deal. Nikki Lee was asking about the red coral bracelet that you're wearing. If you could tour that under the camera. Oh, the red! And if you oh my could gosh! Show it, yes. this, before you take it off, you might want to show it with the red beads. She wants to see it with the beads. Oh yes. And then tour it, please. And that will fit. I have that fitting. Uh, where is that? Ooh. That was on a I'm gonna put both, both for you, so you can see. That will fit a five this point seven five to an eight inch wrist. Ten millimeter, twelve millimeter beads. Eight millimeter beads. So you can see, and then um, yeah, there's that full adjustability, which is so great. Nice curvature, and this is just a really, really smooth, slithery soft um, hammered rings and that is that really cool um the coral I love it because it's got that tomato red orange coral but then you see it's also got the blue red that so it's it's kind of cool because it every it looks good on everybody you know how like oh no it the more the orange coral um orange red looks better on me and then some people's skin tone, the blue red is better for you. And it's literally got both of it in it. So it's it's kind of that really cool color. I always look for the, the ones that have, have that kind of patterning, the best that I can find them. Okay, so I know I'm really particular on my gemstone, like shades, colors, I just, uh, I love gems, and so um, and I, when I design collections, like I say, I'd like to. I don't know where I got this. Okay, just figure it out later, right, Michelle? Yeah. That's <laughs> okay. Just put it this down. is the last out. one. Oh my gosh, not too bad. Okay, I'm, we're supposed to be done right now, but um, the blues. So we did already show the twilight opal, though. So um, I've got to go into the Caribbean because I designed this. Uh, years ago and I finally got three years it took me to bring this family together and I'm just really excited because I love to design things to add on um, and you need a tip to tip and this is the Mac Daddy tip to tip ladies in your Caribbean courts like I'm so excited oh my gosh so yes so you've got two sizes I'm gonna stack the next brace where's the bracelet Oh, it's right here. I'm like, oh, I forgot to put it on the tray. Nope, I didn't. I put it down here. Okay, go ahead and explain both the bracelet sizes because this one's really special. And ladies, this is one that I, I kept saying, it's coming, it's coming, the other pieces. This is a really amazingly uh, 
amazing quality bracelet here. So that will fit a six to an eight inch wrist for $149.99. And then the tip to tip we have in two sizes, a 6.75 fitting a six to seven inch wrist and a 7.75, which will fit a seven to an eight inch wrist for $149.99. The tip to tips are on Jodo. And we love this ring. I'm so excited to finally, like this style, ladies, is absolutely amazing. Now this one, um, did I, this one, am I seeing true? You fit? did, $69.99. I sized up on this one, but you know, the other ones, if you still have it, yes, you had to size up on the other ones. But then on this one, I got smart and said, uh, upsize it just a little bit. So this is just that really beautiful fit however you're gonna wear it. So comfortable. That breathability that that uh, inside custom gallery that we hand do is gonna just come in so handy during this hot weather, right? Mm -hmm. I love this ring that I even made a um, silver fringe panty out of it. Oh, that one. I guess I actually did a bigger size in that one. How pretty is this, right? How gorgeous. Okay, you're gonna watch me just now layer with all of the beautiful opals and such because all of these go together. Um, here are the two pendants and the two earrings. So I, I gave you a stud and I gave you a dangle. But this one's really beautiful because it's literally, I did the work all the way around. So it's truly just, see how it's like, just set in there just so carefully. And so beautiful. The pendant is on special for $79.99. And then I'm in the major because see, you'll see one, this one is a little bigger. Okay. And then the earrings, okay? So you're gonna have either the little stud dangle, okay? So the little stud, or you'll do the really beautiful wire, okay? The stud dangles are on Jodo for $59.99. They're so pretty. I know. I love the post on that with the Janelle Darrell. See, I love these. This is, mm -hmm. I, I like a little movement. I love a, a wire earring. It's my grab and go. Yeah, I'm definitely a, because I've got all these weird, like, um, they, you know, pierce me, not even in the first place and all that kind of crazy stuff. So I just, whatever, I go with it. I just wear pretty earrings so people can't see it with diamonds. So I'm going straight to this collection because I'm going to add on. This is the stone that just is the best ever with the Caribbean quartz. Twilight Opal and Caribbean to me are like two that should just be paired together all the time. So I'm so excited to finally pair these up the way that I always design the gemstones. I wish you really could see more green to this though, ladies. I know a lot of you ladies already have um you know how great the stone is but it's a bummer that I'm, I'm it's not picking up the green that comes out of this twilight it's not even it's really sad it's not that spectacular on it looks pretty on here. can you see the green it's hard like um, it's far away i think it the camera's picking it yeah. up but it's 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 showing blue underneath it here just keeps trying to correct for the blue or something yeah mm -hmm. But anyway, um, Sleeping Beauty Turquoise. Um, did I do full Sleeping Beauty on this or did I do Mexican Sleeping Beauty? You did, uh, uh, just a Sleeping Beauty. Oh no, I did not. Holy cow, that that's probably super expensive. Um, Usually I try to, wow. Wow, that's, that's, that's gotta be a really expensive pendant, huh? $129.99 on Jodo. Oh no. That's not. So, oh, okay. No. Yeah. I must have self corrected then on it. Um, that's, I have this pendant, but get that one. <laughs> Since it's a Jodo, that's, yeah. 
And $74.99 on the pendant there. This is really great. sweet though. It's Sleeping Beauty too. Mm -hmm. it's, it's just a really sweet size. You know, ladies, I, I've not done a ton in that smaller kind of size like this. So that might be what you've been looking for for me. But uh, just cause collectability, that, that's, that's incredible. Okay, watch this. Oh, it brings it all together. Maybe even just here. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, I better show all of the stones. Okay. You know the Royal Bali Blue is my signature. You're not going to see the Royal Bali anywhere. That's me. Um, and Sleeping Beauty Turquoise. Oh, Amazonite. I stuck Amazonite. You know why? Because there's so much Amazonite. So this and the green is supposed to be popping out of here, but see, you can't see it on. So weird. Okay, that's okay. When it gets home, it over delivers. But um, <laughs> just, just a bummer. Um. Okay. That Whoa! Looks, right there, yeah, you go. That looks so good. So that's pretty. Beautiful. Okay, where's all my greens? Oh, I have them over here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm like hello. Okay. And that will fit a 5.75 to a seven and a half inch wrist for one ninety nine ninety nine. These earrings are really awesome too. So I've got this sleepy. Okay, so that that goes to that. Oh, oh, ladies, this was before this Sleeping Beauty turquoise is that really Mac Daddy one. So I know this has been sitting on the website, it, like our website at MSRP for a while now, at the higher price. So I did bring this in last time. I could do a special price like that. Um, one nineteen ninety nine. Your pick, pendant yes. or yeah. This is this is the eight by tens. Okay, so these are the eight by tens that I've got left. I wanted to do that because I just had a whole lot uh, cut and rejected. So the Sleeping Beauty turquoise, like there's all this white patterning, like it's almost like splotches that go through the material. Um, and that comes pretty common, and I don't use that. So we might have most of what we have because um, I thought I would have some to the end of the year, but um, I canceled it while I'm sitting in the back because it's there's just no way. Oh, okay. Oh, where's the yes, this guy. Oh, I have. Okay, ladies, this is real, real. Look at the lotus cut. This is Swiss blue topaz. Okay. If you have ever, for this kind of size, um, I have to tell you, the price point on this is three times what you would ever, even on my fancies. And the color is just spectacular. So I had to put the, the collectible eight by 10. Look at, I did the very, you know how hard this is for us to make Bali chain? I ovaled that out, okay? So I'm really excited. Did I, is this the, is this the first time I jodoed? Uh, yes. One oh my gosh. Okay, then this is crazy because I got so excited. I just thought that I had... No. Exactly. You know, this is so weird when you actually say something, you're like, wait, I said that already? I think I actually dreamt getting excited about this. Mm. And what I just said was what I said in my sleep. That's so weird. <laughs> so I'm, I guess I was very, very excited to um, show this to you ladies, okay? Um, so... It's just, it's just another, like, Swiss blue topaz, they don't, especially in these kind of cuts, but the saturation of color in these and the cutting is, is just spectacular. This is something you would see at JCK in a case, and they'd be buying it to set diamonds around it. Mm. Like, this is, this is that. It's really pretty. Um, because of the color of it, too. So I wanted to put it in a super elegant, I've been holding on to these forever. And I wanted to do it in more of a conservative size. Um, definitely this is, this is just that one where you put it on with your little black dress um, for a really fancy evening uh, event. And yeah, amazing. And you have it priced at eighty nine ninety nine on the Jodo for the pendant. For the pendant, oh my mm -hmm. gosh! I say these things, and then I realize the price I did in is <laughs> ridiculous. It sounds silly. And the bracelet is oh going to fit a five point seven five to a seven point seven five inch wrist. Oh my gosh! Yeah, 
that anyway, I, it's exciting. Like, I know your collection, ladies with me, and some of the gemstones, it's just gonna be really cool. Okay, another one of those really cool bracelets. It's kind of, ladies, are you like obsessed with the style that I'm doing now? Isn't it so cool, like the coral one? Um, just looks great just by itself too, right? But with bangles, yeah. Especially with your summer short tops and stuff like that, just really fun. So the Sleeping Beauty Turquoise bracelet is going to fit a 5.75 to a 7.75 inch wrist. And this is gorgeous. This is another one. I pulled such a huge size on this one. It's so I, was, funny. I don't think I, I paid attention with the size. I must have just pulled random stuff out of the bag this time. <laughs> I usually, if I I, I'm doing it. all these displays for you because I'm like, oh, this has to go with this, this, this. I'm just having fun. Um, so anyway, Michelle, I'm I'll like, double check you next time. I already made myself a note right here. She knows that I do all this, but I'm like, yeah, I probably still need your help. <laughs> Cause I'm like, Ooh, look, I'm over here. Like telling the girls they're like, okay, she's just like, Oh, this is so pretty. And it goes with this and the door. Oh, the ladies would love this. And I'm sitting there telling them everything like before the show <laughs> and I'm laying it out, delinting the trays. Cause see like lots of lint, but anyway, Everybody needs this, no matter what. That is really Because you're always going to get your Mexican turquoise, your Sleeping Beauty turquoise, your all the colors, but it's Kingman turquoise, okay? Um, and this is just the coolest process. So all these really beautiful colors, um, I can hand select the rough to get the different colors. Then we layer it, basically, and compress it, okay? Then, um, so we take the, the real natural, genuine Kingman turquoise, and then what we do is heat up bronze and then let it fill in the cracks. Now, when you do that though, unfortunately, I ruin a ton of the material because sometimes there'll be void spaces that I can't cut the stone out of, but it, it just gives you the most amazing mix of the Kingman turquoise you'll ever gonna see. But it's gonna match back with your Sleeping Beauty turquoise, your Mexican turquoise. Oh, matter of fact, I brought the Mexican turquoise earrings. Mm -hmm. um, out because to me, I, I just love this Mexican turquoise earring with it. And you did and this see. as a this show only too. Oh yeah, well yes. we had the Amazonite earrings that accidentally got on there, and I was like, no, it's my sleep and my uh, my uh, Mexican turquoise earrings. So yes, those are on special. Yes, sixty nine ninety nine. Oh, incredible! Oh, where did this come from? <gasps> We were out of these. Oh my gosh, this is that knife edge uh, tree of life ring. Oh my gosh. This is a great ring. Um, just for some texture and it, it's just such a pretty ring. So if you ladies are looking for just that really cool, you always wear your bigger rings here. Look how, look how pretty that, see how it's graduated in here too. See the dimension and shape on it, so pretty. Very elegant. The architecture on this is just, I, I love it. Very high, high scale, high end. Um, yeah, so great. So hopefully we've got to your size finally. Um, now what I did bring in, I'm having more to go with this though, okay? So this is my, my exclusive Royal Bali Blue, okay? I've got another collection that's going to be matching these. But you ladies are so crazy about the size of pendant and the earrings that I'm doing right now that I thought I would show it ahead of time. But I have a whole three stone collection with a multi bracelet that's gonna go with this. Okay, that's pretty incredible too. But look at the fastening on that. It's beautiful. Yeah, so this is a topaz. And um, I, I love it because you get those little bits of blue undertones but it's very royal like it's mm -hmm. such a perfect name for it. it it really is in a league of its own oh oh my gosh no these came back in i repaired these okay so i'm really picky about stuff so i moved this down a little bit and then i really wanted to reinforce that so i actually sent those and they finally just got back to me from bali it's made it around the world two times <laughs> they are perfect now for you. <laughs> and they are marked at seventy nine ninety nine. Yes, because it, it's literally, I wanted to give you two hoops, okay? So we have our two this show only. So don't forget the other best hoop in the world. Oh, this uh, still life bouquet. This still life bouquet. So if you're into this, okay, 
or you do this style and it is it just cool it's it's just a really beautiful look on i like this part to be on the outside and this towards your face but it's just it's just a really cool uh oversized j hoop that's just again i like something different i don't want you to have really boring stuff i want you to have something just really unique and um did I already show, the, oh, I forgot to show the earrings. So we have the Sleeping Beauty earrings too that go back because I love to do four piece sets. And all of my uh, Sleeping Beauty right now is this color in the ovals. So to me, there's a lot of shades of Sleeping Beauty turquoise, okay? It doesn't always come this saturated with the Robin's Blue. Sometimes it can be a little bit lighter blue. So um, right now, if you're like really a stone snob, you wanna get those together, like, yes. They are like spot on, perfect, perfect matching. Okay, and then uh, pinky thumb. Again, I've got my two best little uh, rings that are just, again, those pieces that are just fun and, you know, kind of stack up a bigger look if you need it. Um, but these are always just fun. So you can always stack up just extra stackers to, you know, give personality to other things that you have. So these are like key pieces like, and also too, to me, if you're in between sizes, sometimes on the rings, yeah, you get a smaller size in this one and it kind of sizes it for you. Cause I don't like the ring sizers, you know, the plastics and stuff. I'd rather use a band ring and, and size up something for myself, so. Mm -hmm. We have a Byzantine and snake chain intertwined bracelets. We have four of them. <gasps> Four sizes. Oh my gosh, I forgot about those. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, have you had this yet or gotten one? Because there's, we got some inventory back in on them. So if we ran out of your size before, I'm bringing it back at a special price again because this is one of the most luxury braces in a torsage, but I did it with my Made chain and the snake chain. So do you see, there's three that are literally have to be soldered into here, but first they're hand woven. All of Bali, like we hand weave it um, on our premise ourselves by master artisans that are the best at it. And this is so easy ladies, literally that's how easy that is, okay? So there's only gonna be a half inch circumference for everybody to wear these though, okay? So go on and look at your size that you're gonna be buying. But Michelle, um, maybe just kind of go over a little bit what that would look like. Okay, so we have a size seven bracelet that's going to fit a five and a half to a six inch wrist. We have a seven and a quarter fitting a five, seven, five to a six and a half. Mm -hmm. We have a seven and a half fitting a six and a quarter to a seven. And then we have a size eight fitting a six and a half to a seven and a half inch wrist. And those are priced at $119.99. Look how pretty that is with within your stack and layer, ladies. I mean, it's just luxury, luxury. And I'm sorry, this this bracelet of this quality with a torsage like this. Yeah, no, you're you're paying big money out in the real world for this type of quality, the quality of the chain. Um, the I mean, just yeah, the, this one I always. Um, so I hope you know your size. Go to the sizing chart. Like it, it will tell you which one you should be getting based off of what size your wrist is, okay? So I am, I'm a six inch wrist. And let me see here. You probably prefer the seven to I five. I think. I guess. Or even the seven and a half. You could wear, let me you see can if wear this three one sizes. is the small one. I, no, I, I can wear two of them. Two like of them. easy, mm -hmm. easy. Three, yeah. Oh, I just actually put on, no, I can wear all three. Yeah, three sizes, you're right. Because I put on the, uh, the third size. But I'll put on the smallest size so you can see, ladies, okay? So this is the smallest size right here, okay? And I have put that one on. So if you want it more fitted, okay, uh, look in that size range. Let me see. So see, this would be fitted. So that see how this one's fitted on me. And 
But see, I, I like the little looser bracelet, so I wouldn't do that one. Mm -hmm. Even though it does fit me, I, I'm, I'm a movie girl, I, I move a lot, so I think probably my best fit is the second one. Yeah, love that. Because I always, um, I, I, I do this a lot with my bracelets too, I play with them. Because it's so silky smooth. But yes, ladies, you know, I'm always like, okay, get your size and know this is, yeah, just one of those truly um, incredible uh, works of art. Yeah, I love this. Okay, so that is it, ladies. So we went 20 minutes over, but anyway, um, I hope there's something that you really love. I know you were shopping, like, I can't believe it must, I'm surprised they didn't break the site because we waited so long to load I the know. product. I know, they're a little later, sorry. I know, it's I'm like, sorry. no. I know. I know, because the Rainbow Moonstone, we've been talking a long time, but the citrine's gonna be coming next week. Um, um, remember, look at the ones that say Jodo because it literally will go off um, back over to 40% off mm -hmm. after, so those are probably the most incredible. The Visha only's, um, Anyway, can't mm -hmm. wait to see what you're gonna pick. I do have a question for you. Yeah, yeah. Uh, they're mm -hmm. having a conversation on mm -hmm. the the twist torsage bracelet. Yeah. Is it torsade or torsage? Like, oh. is it a d? Like, do you, oh, how, I how do, do you say it? I say torsage, but it's, it okay. could be wrong. <laughs> Well, we'll I actually it. just go with I say things and I probably say things wrong <laughs> so somebody probably Amberly probably has the right way at, at, ask Amberly she's really good at stuff like that oh, but I'm pretty sure I pronounce things wrong all the time and then, and then I just keep going with it right. because once I get it I can't it change really it. it's like yeah. it's already in my head and I think that yeah Anyway, I can't believe uh, Friday the AC will be fixed, so you guys did pretty good back there. Yeah, it wasn't yeah. too bad. No. I like it really it's warm, but I always there. like these. I make everybody miserable here. They come in and turn it down. Yes. <gasps> Teresa, oh. Teresa would like to see those two, uh, the beads up close. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is something Please. new that we got. Oh, yeah, the beads are um, oh, it's really pretty because this is the blue quartz, the angel light. This is the blue jade, angel light. Blue quartz. Is it Cal Sydney? It's or blue quartz. Wait a minute. Is this the blue, blue Cal agate, Blue quartz. Oh, agate. And, agate. Yeah. Angel so light. this, yeah, this is actually uh, with, with agate with the glow of that. Yeah. That's more of a Cal Sydney. But that, yeah, that's what we. And think. that is a twenty-six inch necklace with a two-inch extender for one thirty-nine ninety-nine. Teresa BDS two zero one. So what, Teresa? What one would you want me to? Oh, you know what's really pretty with it. Well, gosh, all the opals. I mean, look at that, right? Oh, yeah, oh, you know what? The one that I was wearing earlier, like, oh my gosh, the she light. The she light is oh, so that beautiful. Would be so pretty. The she a, light is like perfect it was with it. Like the pink tray or something. I, last time I saw it. But any of the blues. Oh my gosh, because of that. That. Oh my gosh, the the yeah that that mm -hmm. works. That works like with the blue, right? Mm -hmm. <gasps> Wait a minute. Hello. Oh, now that makes it look expensive. <laughs> um, what else? Oh, here's my she light. I was looking for it. Ooh, look at that. That looks really pretty. Yeah, and of course the blue opals, but uh, oh yeah, the Royal Bali Blue. All oh, that's gonna... <gasps> Actually, the collection I did it with has this, this right here in this collection. Uh, when I bring the multi-bracelet. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. That is it. That so, ladies, it. we'll see you Friday. Okay. And that's when we'll show you the citrine that I didn't get to. And the pink tourmaline and white quartz Ooh. that I didn't get to. 